Right. Hey oh. Wait, did I actually hit you there? Right, so dig good. diggers. Who the fuck's bleeding? We we've just hit the resource camp. We took over. We defeated the QRO force. But truth be told, we don't know what to do. Um, there's a suggestion of putting up a roadblock just down the road, just down there. Um, but beyond that, we're not entirely sure how what to do next, insofar as what this place what is good for. Okay. Uh, the resources generate money for us, which means that we get additional like shit when we finish. Uh, with the area, so we might, if we're feeling brave, want to hit the. There's an AFRS outpost. Um, zero four nine one nine four down a dirt track. It's a bit isolated yeah. from the rest of their position. We could hit that and just then fuck off to the rear. Should we do that now or set up the roadblock first? Uh, what are we going to put on the roadblock? That's the thing. I don't know. It was just, it just... We, we don't make the roadblocks. It's an enhanced roadblock because uh, uh, like in the past three hours I managed to get our armor level up, so now we're getting enhanced. Though now we don't have any. Ah. Right, right, but very, very quickly, what the fuck do we do with this resource? Yeah. We it's what it's. Oh, right. Uh, one bolt press Y. Uh huh. Go to commander menu. Uh huh. You see garrisons? Uh, I see no garrisons. I see uh, USMC recruit squad, squad movement, uh, emplacement details, and uh, ma maintenance. Sorry, squad movement. Uh, squad management. I think. Okay, right. Yeah. <laughs> right, what does it say there? Uh, it says add vehicle, vehicle stats, mount, dismount, or static auto target. Oh, for fuck's sake. Thank you, Xiphon. Thank you. Just flag and recruit people, alright? Uh, flag, alright. Uh, sorry, we're just trying to work this out. Alright. So, welcome, uh, members of the chat. I'm just here with ZF. We're just, uh, doing a bit of Armor 3 resistance. It's a mod thing. And we're just trying to work out what's going on. Right. Oh, taking fire, fuck. Contact, 340, medium. I fucking told you. 340, medium, roger, stand by, long rifle, get in position to engage. Correction, 340, long. Uh, infantry shots, no armor as yet. Thank you, Kaiser. Thank you very much. Thank you. Are they in the forest? Believe so. Stand by. Thank you, Arcus. Thank you very much, Arcus. That's very kind. Okay, squad, just try and deal with this threat first. Roger. Okay, so unit recruitment, Jenny. Yep. Unit recruitment, then what? Uh, you can't do it now. I can't yeah, do it now? Enemies are in vicinity. We need uh, to deal with them. Alright. Sounds good to me. Thank you, Sample, for the compliments, dude. More than welcome. I will endeavour to provide more bullshittery as soon as possible. I fucking hate Horus. Is that another Doncaster thing? Horus being brave. <laughs> Thank you, Lee the Gamer Gal. Thank you, Lee. Shall I try it anyway, the recruitment, Ginny? Where is he? It's gone. But, uh, yeah, you can do it. Uh, Thank you, Coffee. Alright, right, we'll try and do the recruitment thing. Right, so... No, they're nearby. How do you know? Uh, if you try and recruit someone, it'll tell you you can't. Oh, yeah. Right, squad, we need to eliminate this patrol on 340. Squad, advance bearing 340, uh, about 100 metres. Myself and Tom are going to stay up in this house because I've got a long rifle. So rather than come down there, I'll just provide some top cover for you. Also, are I'm you eating? I can't be asked to move. Yeah, go for it. Thank you, Heavy Deception. Thank you, man. We're currently sitting on top of the hill where there's an enemy is. I'm trying to find him. Squad, move three four zero. Oh fuck me! Oh fuck me! Sideways on a bicycle. I just got shot to ever-loving shit there. 
Okay, while I'm unconscious, um... Can't see dick from where I am, I'm moving. Um, so yes, uh, so hi there, G good evening everybody. So I'm just here with, uh... So, so you okay? No. I'm here with ZF Social, uh, ZF Poro, ZF Tom, ZF Digby, and also Chinny. Um, and we're just on the, uh, anti-Stasi resistance server that's been set up. Um, for, well, it's, it's for people that we know. Um, and, uh, yeah, the idea is that Altis, which is the um, Greek island thing here, has been occupied by the Russians. And um, instead of it being Zeus, where we have to um, sort of generate random missions, anything we wish, we have to fight against a, you know, uh, a garrisoned occupation force by hitting supplies and convoys and, you know, like um, their various quick response bases that they've got all over, distributing propaganda leaflets, that sort of thing, uh, and generally building up our public support and our um, international support and our cash reserves and recruitment, that sort of thing. Uh, so it's a big sort of ongoing persistent server armor type thing. Um, so all the equipment we have to find ourselves because we pretty much have to scavenge everything, which is why it's a bit slapdash in terms of what we have available. Thank you, um, Amberito and Cybernetic. Thank you both. Thank you. Um, so yeah, so just gonna chill out and join join the guys this evening. Uh, here. All right. In the torso. So that's him providing medical attention. He can't hear me because I'm unconscious. You, <laughs> Charming. Bandaging the head. Thank you, Thretch. Thank you. Contact north northeast. Holy shit, we're getting warred. <clears throat> I'm gonna give them blood. Uh, Poro, Tom's down. <clears throat> Go get Tom, I'll deal with this. Oh, uh, yep, he's gonna do the blood. This div. Ooh, that felt close. Uh, one man down definitely wasn't shot by me Thank you, by Elias. misidentifying him. <laughs> Are you done with the blood? That yep, warfire is now walking us. Yeah, it's getting cut. Ooh, there goes Digby. One more friendly down. Shit, mid sentence. He's dragging me, he's picking me up. Call me, you fat cunt. <laughs> man from Doncaster doesn't like hiking. Now he's carrying a dude. It's coming through the shots. Oh god. God, they're uh, this, this is exactly why we need to do with those bases, because of the mortars. Ooh. So the Russians are... Yeah, their quick response forces are now mortaring our position. I am fucking glad I got out of there. Check in, who's left? Okay, I've been put on the ground again. Digby's down. How do I get him up? Alright, time to get up. Um, hold control Thank you. over our Windows key. Thank you very much, dude. Uh, oh, I'm unconscious again. You still need blood, stay down. I can only start helping others as soon as I'm fucking benching myself. I mean, you, you can't really do anything else. But here, have some blood. Cool. So I, I fell unconscious due to low blood pressure. Right. Who am I playing with? I'm playing with about five, six members of ZF and uh, Chinny. Wait, no, one, two, three, four, uh, five. No, wait, did you serious? What? Five, five members of ZF. I think they've stopped. And Chinny. Right. Don't borrow me, stop. You're you're bored, Cursor Forage. Yes, oh, you will be bored. Armor is not one of these action-packed things. It's like a mill thing. Back over here. Ah, shit. We're still getting more. Um, right. Okay. Pushing towards I'm you. I'm gonna go down in a bit. Thank you. Cool. Injecting morphine. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you, Black Boss. Thank you. Oh, I need more shit. Now I'm going to go die. Right. Okay. Right, squad, we need to move bearing 340 to grab the wounded and get them out of there and drag them back up. Fuck. Thank you, Lily. Thank you. Don't attempt to treat them there. Just pick them up and get them out of the mortar fire to the buildings to the south. We've got to get them out. So there's one being treated. 
I see Poro's body. Yeah, just go. I'll be right behind you. Just lift them. Lift them and go. I see Poro's body. This is social. I'm badly wounded. Uh, carrying uh, taking him back to the flag. This is Soviet. I've got Poro. I'm lifting him back to the flag. Okay, got you, dude. I see you found body armor this time. Uh, didn't help you, though. Right. Okay. Just pick him up, dude. Don't, let's not pick, patch him up in the mortar area. This place got fucking targeted. Okay. Right. So, to the audience, to the, the chat. So, yeah, as said, we're, we're resistance fighters trying to resist Russian occupation. Um, we are operating from a farmhouse to the south of here. And we just hit this, uh, well, it's like a, it's like a dump, isn't it? It's like a, it's like a garage. That's not good. Vehicle scrapyard thing. Oh. Okay. Uh, thank you for doing that there, the busy builder. Take game requests. Not really. I just play with the, the ZF guys. I'm not really interested in game requests. Um, never did. I just want to play with my mates. Alright, getting back to the house, then I'll patch up Poro. Thank you, uh, Tith... Tith... Sorry? Tith... I'm not sure how you say your name. Thank you, dude. Right, okay, there's the house. I think somebody's in the doorway. I think that's... Hang on. Thank you, Zumanta. Thank you, man. Right. Just want to get Poro into this house, then I'll start patching him up. Right, here we go. Putting him down. Oh. Oh, no. Damn, he bled out. Shit. Before I could get him. Poro bled out before I could save him. Thank you, Geek. Thank you very much, Geek. Tom's down. Dig. Oh, looks like the whole squad might be eliminated. Shit, I thought he'd be alright. Carried him all that way. Rest in peace, Poro. You will never be forgotten. Hmm. Crap. How's the campaign going? Not well. Well, we've taken over this junkyard, but then we got mortared. Oh, bang, the Quebec's coming. We're going to have some direction. Social's dead. What's your position? South, 100 metres. Moving to you. Look at all those bandages. Hang on. Digby's down here, injured. Unless his marker simply has not updated. Whoa, nope. Fuck no. No. Contact 340. Infantry patrol. Looking for Digby. Gotta pull him out of here. No. Fuck. Throwing impact grenade. Don't hit the branch. Oh! Try again. Crap. Where is Digby? Fuck me. I'm gonna get murdered. No. Get your head down. Fuck. Don't deceased over. Was too late with the blood. Did you find Digby? Digby's still down here somewhere. He's... Can't figure out where he is. Oh, fucking hell. God, that's close. Come on, come on. Gotcha. Thank you, Zyturiex. Thank you, Zyturiex. There's Chinny. Fuck. Digby's down. Fuck, Chinny. Let's just get out of here. Get back to the base. Right, yeah. Good idea. Grab a car. We'll, we'll link up with the others and then move to a new objective. Shit. QRF force coming. 
The Russians are making a push to get this junkyard back. Reloading. I do have a stolen rocket launcher from the Russians on my back. Push comes to shove, I could use it. I think we're about to reach shove. A heavy armored vehicle. Yeah, just get to the car. Where's the car? Jenny, move bearing one four zero back to car. What's your position? Position is zero five nine two oh one. Move bearing one four zero two hundred meters. You hear the beep? Come to me. On my way, stand by. Gotcha. Cool. Nice one, man. Get the fuck out of here. This was botched. Go. Botched. Botched. Thank you, Barber. Thank you, Barber and Zill Design. Thank you kindly. Right, we'll head back to base and regroup with the others. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, this is Falcon Actual. Anyone back at base receiving? Receiving. Um, most of us are here now. Okay, uh, well, Operation Botch, we're RTBing, we'll be with you in a few moments and then we'll re re plan. Thank you, Banana and Calamity. Roger, Terminator, Banana and back, Calamity, uh, and Key, thank you. Hang on, we'll decide when we get there. Yeah. Dude, what are you doing? We've got to go. Resources are essential, we need that truck. Sh sure. Uh, no, Poetic, I'm afraid Cyanide and I will never play together again because he touched my bum and he didn't even pay me. I mean, come on. No, it's not, it's not as if I work for free anymore. I think we started to relax a bit too early there, didn't we? Yeah, well, there was a, another QRF force and it came out of nowhere. I don't think that was a QRF, I think that was just a patrol. Well, uh, fair enough. Right, we'll get with the others and then see what... To be honest, I don't really know this mod, so I don't really feel comfortable giving, like, specific orders. Oh, I see, you towed yeah, the thing. Sorry? You towed the thing. Yeah. You can actually set up the tow chain. It's very funny. Right. Cool, we're almost there. Okay, base, Falcon, elements are nearly back. Uh, for two minutes. Roger. Uh, it looks like the power plant is currently under attack. They already lost four people. Copy that. Uh, I wonder if Quebec's on his way in. He is. He's on Armour th Armour 3 now. Yeah, he knows way more about this mod than I do. He's been on Armour 3 for a while. Like, he might not oh, is he? Okay. Uh, the Godfather plays games. No, I'm just fucking with people. <laughs> Cyanide and I are still very close friends. We play all the time. Oh, it's over there. <laughs> well, all the time. He's been busy with uni at the minute. Because he's got, like, his finals or some shit. He's busy. Hey, yo. Well, that was a... That was a shit show. Ooh, watch it. Yeah, we just got fucking... We've got more people now, at least. Right. Yeah, yep. got fucking that shagged. Was a, that was a classic creeping barrage day. So to whomever the mortar man is on the enemy side, he knows what the fuck he's doing. Yeah. Right, cool. So what's um, what do you think the the next course of action would be? I mean, we're obviously going to lose that in a minute, but is does that matter? It's yeah. gone. User joined your channel. Oh, it's gone. All right. Um, I mean, it's coming in from the base. Can we even take the base? We, we can, can attack the outposts. And yeah. Should we attack the outposts and destroy them? Well, that depends which which one was hitting resources. Was it the base or was it the outpost? Uh. Hang on. Sorry, just fiddling with my gear. We could just hit any base. Well, I don't know. Sorry, I I, I don't un understand this mod. I can't really call the shots. 
Hang on. I mean, Digby, do you know how, do you know how this mod this mod works? Uh, as far as I can work out, we basically need to increase okay. our manpower to the point where we can become self-sustaining. Okay. So we need to attack take and hold bases so the idea is, is that we take a base we dump a big fucking garrison on it of ai mm -hmm. they defend it against the russians who attack it um and then we hit other objectives to increase the size of our our element basically so hey, what's the first did it hey yo, welcome so what's the first step then what should we do uh every good insurgency works on the hearts and minds of the people so we need to start providing the key infrastructure that they require in order to be a, uh, basically in order to get on with their life because you need to establish a, a parallel state sure so, so, so the government sustaining a police force you have to become the police in that city sure you need but a power plant you need you need power you need resources you need a, a means of manufacturing so well, you need to hit user joined your power channel and the probably the factory itself and establish a like a zone we hold Okay, but oh, sorry, yeah. sorry. Okay, what we need to keep bad? we need to keep it simple. What specifically right now should we attack? As resources. We, so we, we just dump. so we need to go back to the same place we just hit. Yeah. Back to the same place we hit. Retake it. So oh, girl, a, yeah, we're gonna take NPCs with us. Why the yeah. Take what NPCs with us. What do we hold? Yeah. Uh, what uh, yeah. We currently uh, hold the Zerta Galati yeah. Abdera uh, and the power plant. Uh, can you give me promotion? To squad lead? Uh, you want to be squad lead? Yeah, I'm just trying that. Okay, you, you're gonna do like you can lead us. Yeah, sure. Huh? Cool. All right then. Uh, so. Uh, we're trying to set resources. Let me see. I've got my leader pants on. How do I? I I don't I don't have a button to do that. Um, and one more is constant. Yeah. Click on me. Leave and agree. Bottom life promote. No, I've just got leave or disband. Oh, standby. That's it. Yeah. All right, you give it a go. Right, forwards in command. I'm gonna be much more useful once I find like. Okay. The, do you know how to read a graph? A bit busy right now, sir. So I can't really answer that. That's because you need to use actual map and compass. Use the terrain yes, features yeah. around you to work out where you are. Terrain feet. Oh my god. You <laughs> massive nerd. Okay. Right. Okay. So let me come over here. Let me give you a basic map reading. Then. All right. Okay. What the fuck is that sound? I'm not if sure. You, um, if you have some money left over and don't use it, if you press C or Y for the other kid that you have, you can assign some money to me so I can buy more units. Uh, sorry? Do you want us to do what? Okay, I can go. I'll press Y. Yep. Give, give him money, money basically. Give him money. Uh, 100 euros to buy it. Just give him like... One like a two hundred or so. It takes like fifty-seven to buy one millisecond. All right, cool. I see what you're doing. I so see. Is that, is that to FIA Foxtrot Indigo Alpha? Hmm? So that's donating to FIA. No, 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 to me, the player. I can't access the money. Sorry, I'm just fucking love how Digby's getting a map lesson <laughs> in the fucking background. Yeah. Alright, so now we just need to get a truck across there, yeah? Okay. Is he really, really teaching him X, Y coordinates? Thank you, Covers. Thank you very much, Covers. Thank you. <laughs> what are we doing, Havard? We're, we're just staging an attack on the resource dump just north of us, which is what we did a minute ago, but we lost. We're trying again. Are we getting it? Not yet. <clears throat> Too quiet? Yep, I know. It's quiet for me as well, not just you. Uh, if you have yep, nothing I can do. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you. It's not like a TeamSpeak setting. They are lit they are further away from me. So I can't up their volume. They're further away from me. Thank you, PXBN. Right. Just going to 
Talent of Voice. Hang on. Ba, 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 ba. Cool. Far be advised, driving this truck, we will be over. Yeah, Shouldn't be a problem. I mean, we're. Short, we don't even have to take the truck, we're so close. Get the truck, digital. All right. Continue the lesson on route. All aboard, coming aboard. Come on, Mike. All right. What do you mean? Uh, so looking hey, we completed this attack and we didn't even do anything. Uh, no, that means we're sending an attack. We've got like five militia men with us right now, it's small support. They're gonna be there with us. And as soon as we clear the entire area, we should be able to set up a garrison and buy more units directly there. Okay. But for now, we've got a small group with us, which is going to support us. They only have shit weapons, I don't expect much. Like, yeah, the Alright, let's do it. Uh, right, already? Tom, you're not in the group. Are we all aboard? Last call, last call. Yeah, I think we're looking good. Go, go, go. They're not in, they can just walk. Shut up. Your battle sandals. Thank you, Assassin. Thank you kindly, Assassin. Thank you, Luxor. Thank you, man. Most kind. Let me know when to stop. It keeps, it keeps drifting back towards north for no reason. Just the block block on. When you open That's my line. What do you mean? <laughs> Impenetrable. <laughs> oh, shit, Nick, we are about to be sued. Thank you, Twed. Thank you. Oh, bugger. Well, it was nice knowing you all. I yep. sell the house and everything. Yeah. Find social stuff within the next 100 or so meters. If you look to your left, you will see a wild herd of civilians. That's shit for the civilians, by the way. Ooh. Oh, God. Ooh. They, they do move in herds. <laughs> look, they're FBI's judging us. Thank you, Greedy Potato. Thank you, Greedy. Alright, rock and roll. Shots 300 long. Hmm. It's an 
garrison engaging the what's left of our garrison anyway, engaging the enemy. Possibly. All right, everyone, start moving forward. We're moving towards one, three, ten. Copy that. Move. Who's firing? Thank you, Synergen. Thank you. Hey, are you engaging something on the road? Yeah, we've got some enemies direction about 250. 250. Hostile machine gunner 300, traitor going over our heads. Thank you, Roxnox. Thank you. Thank you, Yefri. Thank you, man. Contact 330 Infantry. Long. I'm moving. Reloading. We've got multiple friendlies down. Social has been hit. Fuck me. Kill. Contact down. There's at least two more friends. Reference the break in the wire fence and the small lump in the middle of the compound there behind that. I found social. I got him. Stand by. No, no, I got it. You, you go. Dude, go. Don't have two people working on... You the medic. Alright, you, you got him, you got him. I'm moving. Be advised, be in, uh, armored patrol coming up the road. Anti-tank, I've got it. Anti-tank, I've got it. Whoa. 180. Clear my back blast. Oh, shit. Drop on the ground, just lost somebody. 80 is engaging. No eyes on APC. APC, pass by. 80 standing down. Yeah. Breaching yeah. compound. Breaching. Yeah. Everyone breach. Whoa, fuck me. It's Enemies in the... In a concrete pipe. See it? Oh, that's, uh, Clear my back blast. Clear my back blast. Clear it. Fucking hell. Ah! Good hit. I got it just before I was down. Soviet style. He just hit me with a bullet. I'm okay. I'm okay. Fucking hell. Right, let's move. Let's do it. Let's move, move. Fucking hell. Getting fucking peppered. Yeah, I took a bullet right to the torso. Right. 
patch that up. I'm okay. Moving. Check that spacing. We're so clumped. Don't advance into somebody's position. Don't clump. Behind your pro. Thank you, the pro. Thank you, man. I found some uh, dead troopers. Uh, they've got some equipment in the burnt out house. Clear, no eyes. Both these blokes had no intelligence on them. Thank you, B. Williams. Thank you, man. All oh, round coming zero to Very zero. Quick. Zero to zero. Repeat bearing. No eyes. Zero to zero. Uh, sporadic gunfire from zero to zero. I think the enemy might have moved. Just like the occasional rifle round. Thank you, Drogi. Thank you, man. That's very kind. Yes, there's a c civilian right there. Taking the flag. Oh! Contact 4 0, infantry. Medium range. I'm not firing fucking, fucking potato spuds or something. A fucking Probably weapon. Bearing. Yeah, it's actually. Marksman scratch two. Looks like all of them. No, nope, one still standing. Fucking stupid. One more still shot. Walk forward and finish them off. They're still no. Copy, advancing. Contact four zero. Fuck me. He's hit. Whoa, Jesus, that was closer than that. Thank you, Nirathan. Thank you very much, Nirathan. Nine millimeter subsonic. All right. Getting hit, I just heard someone got shot. I'm guessing that was social. Okay. So for the Twitch chat, for those watching, perhaps not familiar with what's you know, familiar with what's going on, um, this is a sort of persistent server in which 
Altis has been occupied by the Russians, and we are a sort of civilian. Well, we're we're a guerrilla force. We're we're civilians who are fighting as a resistance to try and overthrow them. Um, so the the sort of the main conceit of the uh, the mod is that we can sort of switch between our civilian clothes and um, guerrilla clothes, and obviously we're fighting instead of a uh, well a, a campaign of, of direct fighting against a, a modern military. We're sort of fading in and out of the woods, performing insurgency actions. Um, so we're moving from a small farmhouse to perform raids and then hopefully get out before the QRF force squ you know, squashes us. Um, eventually, as the mod progresses, you can uh, take towns and territory and, uh, you know, sort of build up public support and actually have a front line and it becomes a proper, a proper battle. So wound and I'm pretty fucked up. Can someone... Uh, no, no, this is Greece, as in Altis would be one of the Greek islands, so this is, this is Greece, it's based on Greece. Oh, that sounds bad, that sounds like a BRD. A BRDM. That's a Russian APC. Yeah. I can't remember. Then it's, uh, it's like resistance, but... Like, it's a... medic and he's down. I can't remember what the mod's called. I missed, I missed, I missed. Uh, any more AT lying around on the ground? Did that bloke we just shot was uh, an AT, wasn't he? It was, grab it. Okay. Oh, shit. Contact 270. Thank you, Pika Chop. Thank you, Pika. Thank you, man. Yeah, I didn't realise Venomous. We, we, we've got to deal with, you know, whatever guns we can scavenge, really. I thought this would be a bigger gun than it actually was. Um, yeah, just while, while we wait. Um, yeah, today has been good. Uh, this weekend's good. I'm just relaxing with my friends. Um, yeah, the late, oh, insofar as YouTube is uh, concerned. Uh, so I finished the Mountain Blade video at the end of last week on a Sunday. Uh, it did the rounds on with my patron, with my crowd funders, so my Twitch subs and my patrons on Monday and Tuesday, um, and then on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I did some light pre-production work on uh, on the next YouTube video, which is it's just a way of saying I properly sorted out my hard drives. And then next Monday, I begin the next video, whatever it shall be. Well, I know what it shall be. The, uh, I put a poll to the patrons and the Twitch subs, and they selected so. The next edit edit job will begin on Monday, and then it normally takes me about three to four weeks, approximately, to finish a ten-minute video. I will try to keep it ten minutes this time, so it doesn't bloat out of control, because the last one did bloat out of control. To be fair, twenty-seven minutes is a big editing effort, which is why it took ten weeks. Oh God. What happened to the video? I say, Wes. Ooh. It's a ten-parter, and I finished nine parts. The last batch of work was on Jan in January. Clear back blast. Ten weeks for a video. Did Target I work ten minutes every two days? No, I worked for eight to ten hours every day, including. The subsequent the three weekends before its release. Thank you, Vidcito. Thank you. Fuck. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, bloody hell. How many of us got sh All of us? Did all of us get shagged? Oh, oh he's, sweet Jesus. He's AI. Hey, yo. Uh, Holy hello. shit, that was. Yeah, we got murdered. 
That yeah. was a bit of a. So what? The kill response. So how are we struggling? Is it, is it like the QRF? Do we not have like enough anti APC? Like you're all mm. taking tubes, right? Not all of us. No, I mean I can't. Oh no, no definitely. Maybe. Look, it doesn't matter. They're super light. They're like two kilograms or something. <laughs> Yeah. No, everyone needs a tube. Everyone needs a tube launcher. We all need a tube launcher. Oh, Thank you, digital. Please. Yeah, it's like standard yeah. armor. Everyone carries a tube launcher. So what happens at the end there, Digby? I Thank you, Lewis. Thank you. Into a fine uh, pink mist. I killed a BMD basically by face fucking it with an RPG 26. <laughs> killed in the process. So. Uh oh. Is that That's hostile? An enemy helo. Uh, I'm getting an IGLA. Um. Uh, where is it coming from? Um. North, it sounds. Fucking okay, hell. How'd you lock? Okay, let's go. Alright, you lock for the eagle? Hold it, hold. Uh, oh, no. Hold the right mouse button. Sit, clear my back blast. Actually, no, I won't fire it here. Holy shit. Watch your back blast, watch your back blast. Someone else fire first. Where's my lock? Come on. Why won't it work? There we go. So that. Oh. So that was my kill, yeah? Yeah, we're saying that's my kill? That wasn't a kill, was it? No, no I'm pretty sure it's a kill. No. Like, didn't you no, hear in the distance the, the sort of no, explosion that, that, that sound? sounds like it's coming back. No, no, I'm pretty sure it was a kill. Oh, shit. That's uh, so Fuck. can you reload and get ready with that yeah. thing? Uh, yeah, hurry. But it was a kill. This, this, this is clearly a new one. Holy shit. <laughs> you get it? That still counts as my, mine. Somehow. Nice. Uh, yeah. Oh, did you see what I wrote you? you? What you wrote me? Oh uh, yeah. Uh, if you resign for a commander, I looked up some of the stuff on how to do it. Uh, sure. Am I commander? Oh uh, yeah. Uh, okay. Hang on. Um. Oh, I'm lying and then resign. <laughs> I resign. Sure. Right. So are we are we attempting it again? Uh, sure. Yeah, this time, time I'm gonna set up some commander stuff, so I'm gonna give you some. Sure. And this time wait, wait, you wait. need to take a tube launcher, guys. That we got so many of them here. We got 68 of them, and they're really light. Where are we getting them from? Well, they come in the big crates. It's a single shot disposable, so everyone should carry one. Should we bring a vehicle this time, like a cargo thing, and just do a smash? It? Nah, we we can do it. I think we just need to deal with those BDRs. Which one is it? It's just called a um. RPG 26. Really? It's super light. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's way too much. Well, all right, yeah. Minute. I'm gonna get some table ties. These guys are annoying me. Alright. Pines wouldn't be a terrible idea if we were really trying to keep a place. Because I feel like we're not bringing enough firepower to take it. But the firepower is just BRDM. Yeah, it's just BRDMs. A light skinned armored vehicle. Yeah, but what about that helicopter that's hit? Yeah, but that didn't. But it's just that's just an MI-17. It's a, it's just a transport helicopter. Uh, yeah, the the MI the hips aren't so much of an issue, in all honesty. Yeah. Look at your fancy fucking guy. It's just each time we've been defeated, it, we've been sort of either it was more to the first one to be fair, but just yeah. have one of these tubes. Get used to the sights because they're a bit weird. You got to aim a little bit high. Fire, forget. Aim high, huh? If you're within 200 meters of the target, aim below it because your your uh, your tube will jump as you fire it. Mm. Okay, uh, so I can you know just use the extremely high. <laughs> you'll you'll work it out. The highest sights I've ever seen. You'll you'll work it out. Push comes to shove. Uh, press press control and then right click. Right, okay, I've got a Mark 11 Mod Zero Woodland with a decent sight on it uh, in my backpack and an AK for more close range shit. Thank you very much, Lewis. Thank you for, for subbing, Lewis. No, oh, God. stay away from Get out of it. 
Oh, you've made it run away, Tom. What's he done? Oh, running away. Wait, wait, ready. I'm gonna fucking shoot these AI in a minute. No, we need them. Do yeah, it. Yeah, the AI was like shooting that. me. Like no, the AI, AI was not here. Well, at least we have. Wait, wait. Do we get these people because we actually are holding a village now? No. Uh, they just turned up. I didn't do anything. No. Right. Uh, I'm gonna do one thing here. So I'm still the. We own power plant 15. That's great. Wait, no, that's just power plant. It's got 15 people with it. And we all and we've got allegiance from Serta. So I have to set the gun up every time I want to use it, but that's Adera? not at the end of yeah. the world. Cool. Wait, yeah, no chest armor. Mm. Okay, okay. Oh shit. Uh, Thank you, Mantazza. Priority target. What's that? The AFRF money convoy in Oreo Castro. You'll get it. Oh. Pull up oh. truck. The what, sorry? Get a truck. What's happened? Oh no. No, no, no. It's a uh, money truck. Money truck that we're going to go we, after. We, we can't. It's too late. It's already set off. We don't know where it is. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's just, no, third time's a charm. Let's go back for the ammo dump. This time we can do with two launches to deal with the BRDMs. Thank you, Ying. Thank you. Also, hey, you know entrenching tools are here, you know. We have entrenching tools? No, entrenching tools are in the... Office. Sweet. Also, remember grenades. It's you know, you, If you're infantry, you should have grenades. I'm kind of full up of uh, medical supplies here, you know. <coughs> medic. Yeah, yeah. But infantry, yeah. As a, as a medic, you're kind of exempt. As a, and any other any other type of infantryman, you should be carrying at least two frag grenades. Right. Yeah. If um, we had any frag grenades, that'd be good. We got RG5. Right, people. Do I need info? ammo for my so, launcher. Uh, shut up. Separate. Oh, uh, did you? If, if you've got a lot of money on the top, if you look right there, um, if you don't use it, if you don't buy any vehicles for yourself or anything important, donate most of it to the FIA. Because then I can get more units and build up more stuff. I've curr I'm currently researching on how to do most of it. And I've already learned how to build a garrison so and how to set up. Okay, specific. Sorry, how do we do it? It's short and simple? Uh, short and Hit simple, y, press Y. y. Yep. Player money. money, donate $100 to FIA. Okay. FIA. As, as much as you want to, you don't need to. All of it. Alright. Oh, fuck me, I'm almost captain. Oh, my. Cool. Almost a captain, eh? Um, almost captain, not quite. Cap captain Chinny. Hmm. I don't quite like the ring of it. I'm, I'm fairly less tenant. You, you honestly sound like. Thank you, Shadow. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you. <laughs> what are these guys do? You're gonna have to give us content for all these events we references. You, you don't know what the battle. You don't know what the right, battle of Trafalgar was. He's, he's oh, oh yeah, of course. Um, Digi, Digi, you know the Battle of the Alamo? It's like that, but for the British. Oh, okay, cool. At sea. At sea. Off the, off the coast of Spain, where we kick the shit out of the Spanish and the French, despite being outnumbered. And also, ships and men. And also, yeah, yeah. as a okay, point of pride, it, uh, in the middle of the battle, both sides generally just, on uh, multiple occasions, basically went, eh, let's go looting. And then just basically ignored orders to start going to loot each other's ships for ages. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wasn't you, guys get, you guys Wasn't get way better history than we do. Because the, the prize money for capturing yeah. a French ship was yeah. way more than just taking part in the battle. Yeah. The ships would board each other and then be like, nah, we're all right, thanks. Yeah. We've got a ship. Yep. We're kind of out this battle now. Like, all, pretty much all captains. Of history. America came in at, like, the tail end of imperialism. By the time we were, like, strong enough to do anything, everyone was all human rights. And you barely, the colonies. You've barely had any history. You've existed for, like, a couple of days compared to the rest of us. Yeah, 125 odd okay, years. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, maybe the culture. <laughs> be quiet, you youngster. Be, like, be shh. You guys have gone through countless the adult decades. nations are talking. Hey, hey, Soviet. Yeah? I've got a joke. Yeah? What's the difference between the United States and a yogurt? What? A yogurt has culture. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna. He's gonna. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Shame. Don't worry, I'm a medic. Thank you, Bruno. I'm gonna touch the vehicle thing. Arrest the man. Right, okay, so are we ready I to go? Ah, the typical actions of a nation that didn't want to pay us for us defending them against the French. Hey, you know, I mean, in essentiality, it's all it. Americans are, are just Brits who thought, oh, you know what, fuck it, I wanna rebel. 
<laughs> all they are. Right. Thank you, Radar no, and it, back. It, Thank that's you. all the answer. <laughs> they yell about no taxation without representation when what we were basically saying is, you know, you guys keep starting wars with the French. You maybe want to contribute and like pay for all the troops that oh, we're having to stay in North America you, to defend you. you. The first thing you taught us as a colony was fuck the French, and then you get upset at us for doing exactly as you said. Yes. Yeah, it sounds like you don't have the proper because motivation. Because you kept dragging us into war. Anyway, chat, so I hope you're all having a lovely Saturday uh, here on... Welcome to Twitch, everybody. I hope you're all okay. Um, so, yeah, so over here, um, just chilling, playing a bit of... That's no, fine. Um, right, we ready to go? Might work now. <laughs> hey! Right. Fre what? Friends who want to stay friends do not discuss politics, religion, or money. This isn't politics, it's history. Fine. Yeah. It, it, is, it is history. <laughs> <laughs> Tom, are you having fun there? Thank you, you dangerous. Thank you. History, are you really right. even friends? So, are you having fun there? Yeah. If you no, can't brag really on the fact that you have lots Wait. of it and someone else has none, then, you know, thank you, it's Chief. a good recognition thank you. of how diverse we are. And how's that history working out for you, Mr. Tap and Warner? Mmm, mmm, really important these days, aren't you? Yes, we are currently hosting the Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting in London at the moment. All 53 countries that still have Elizabeth as their head of state. Yes, so shall because we, they shall can't be bothered. On? Okay, to be fair, Elizabeth is different than England. <laughs> Can, 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 can we talk about perhaps like the, our, our struggle to free Altis as opposed to, you know, these other oh, yeah. names? Yes, we should go back to that. Should Remember, we're all Greek, Greek, not British. We are. We're just asking the best way to contact the yes. British Empire to solve all our so problems. We, so we are the Greeks trying to overthrow the Russians who have occupied us for reasons of something. Wait, we're Greek? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Tom. <laughs> 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 right. User joined your channel. Can we go, yeah? I see, we're waiting okay, to go, so talk. Shoot the Russians. Right. Alright, everyone, truck has been Alright, let's go! Let's go, lads! Copy that. Thank you, Soros, everyone, thank oh you. Don't forget to set up your radio. Alright, good point. Right, this is it! 110, yes? I'm feeling this one. This is gonna be our, oh, our victory. Sweet, that this time we gotta do it. Yeah, hang on. Okay. Is this just me, or is there a lot more of us than last time? NPCs. A smaller truck. <laughs> hey Poro. Hmm? Oh God, You're a small. mother cunt. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank you, Snake Yellow. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, several of the AI aren't in. Yeah, wait. Um, they can't fit. Need a different truck. Can we make them drive themselves? User left User your channel. Your channel. Mm. Just, just get the American out. User left your channel. Hang on. I take up never, like three spots by myself. Never let the yeah. AI drive in this game because they will fuck it up. Standing by. Okay. Everybody in? Right better. Wait, uh, yeah. Why is I my mean, door open? Yep. Oh. Give me a minute. Fuck me, this is cozy. Oh, it is cozy. Hey, yo. There is, we go. Is that Tom shoulder. down there? Yeah, yeah. it's better. For Altis, everybody! For Altis! For Altis! For Altis! For Altis! <laughs> the organization is not called the Mill. Thank you, Mad Max. Thank you. My wife, who are you? Are we good? Did you lower your gun? Lower your gun, did you? Lower your fucking gun. I don't do that. Double tap left control. Yeah. There we go. Right. Wait, 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 wait. What? Hold the fire off this shit. Huh? What? What's he doing? Fuck's sake, I thought you could get in the back of that one. It's much faster. What? Right, for all this. For all this. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna take over, we're gonna take over this resource dump. We're gonna hold it against the Russian aggressors, and then we're going to use its resources to free our brothers and sisters and our grandmothers. And our grandmothers. No, oh, whoa, dude, no. I'm deaf. Holy shit. No firing of your guns. Hey, Zigbee, give me the song. 
Ja. Thank you, it's Peter. Thank you. Jenny, listen to your squad leader. There we go. Alright, everyone does a bark. Feraltis, lads. Feraltis. Thank you, Mabu. Thank everyone you, Kanji. Make sure your radios are set up and working. Check, check. Alright, Red October standing by. <laughs> All the people going towards Hill 2 are on Team 2. The rest is Team 1. Copy that. Now we have to figure out who's in Team Team. Yeah. If you're not me or Poro, you team two. <laughs> right, let's go, lads. Start moving. Okay, fair enough. S start moving bearing zero, boys. Alright, everyone. Move as soon as you're ready and your stamina is allowing you to. Okay, so team two going to hill two, correct? Yep, exactly. Just follow the marker approximately, try to stay out of their sight and move on to the hill. They've got a good firing position from there. Take the AI and stick the onto hill one and give you fire support from there. Copy that. Fire discipline, boys. Hold your fire and let's fire it upon. I'm a little bit far ahead, so I'm going to wait for you to catch up with the AI. It's alright, I'm going to be a little bit far behind because, you know, full. Yeah, the AI a bit slow, both in speed and in mind capacity. Keep moving, bearing zero one zero. Who's over there? Social, you're off course. Move zero one zero. Where's he going? We're oh shit. Get up, pussy out your mouth, Tom. Don't cut the corner. <laughs> Fuck, never mind. I'm worried about running into the patrols and alerting them. Thank you, Coed Bowler. Thank you, Coed. Uh. No, no, no one cares. It's only digital. <laughs> yeah, digital. Where the hell are you going? That doesn't matter. Everyone can get it. What's digital? Yes. Okay. So far, so good. So speaking to the chat, I'm moving with my, my fire team, my resistance members, uh, as we make our third... I uh, think he's just AFK. Our third attack on I'm this ammo radio, resource dump. Reset itself. We're here on Altis. Yeah, whenever you're in the arsenal, our home. You have to redo it. I was unaware of that. Taken thing, by yeah. the Russians. Okay, Luigi. I hear a dog. Yes. Enemy dog patrols. I can hear a fucking dog barking. Fuck. You see me on the hill, did you? Bearing? Uh, from you? I don't fucking know. Where am I from your bearing? Uh, 130. Ish. Do I 
southeast or west, just simply. Southeast. Yep, there is no Zeus. This game mode isn't a Zeus. It's a. Hey, social. I'm not coming towards you, I think. Right. Yeah, we're doing the right thing, social. Why is it always the Russians? Because they're the enemy in the armor. Th well, in the game that we've got. Thank you, Mrs. Whateverest. Thank you. As in, they're a faction that's been put in the game and it's well realized. Advised, hostile MIA, direct front. Watch yep, yourself. social. Yeah, I was going to say, do you hear a helicopter? But Digby's just. Yeah, no, Jenny, I'm just lost. I we should be alright. North, north position of Hill 1. Just the advice is coming in. Fuck. Okay, did you fire your weapon? That's coming over us. Mm hmm. It's alright, it's really hard to spot infantry with an MI 17. That didn't help. Contact MI17 320 medium. Yeah, I see him. He's coming in. He's gonna land by the looks of things. Hold. If you have ideas, shoot him. Otherwise, wait until he goes away. Don't load up your own position. Thank you, Red Panda. Okay, did you see the, you, you see the forest, yeah? Which forest? The big one. Maybe. Right, can you see the dirt path? Yep. Head in the opposite direction. MI17 on 120 is unaware of our presence. Let's go into Chini and Digi. Let's keep moving. Careful. North squad, keep moving. Lost eyes. Fuck. We're hearing gunfire, is that you guys? That's the helicopter. Chopper's engaging Shinny and Digital. I think if we're gonna go, we need to go now. Fuck. The enemy gonna know that something's not right. North squad is almost on the hill, three minutes. Thank you, Captain. Thank you. No, you suck at following direction. Uh, Digi, if you have to, grab the vehicle and drive up closer so we tell you. Uh, I, I just see, you, I see everybody marked on the map, so what, what's, what's the problem? You can't see yourself. So? Oh, uh, don't. Pick up the GPS, dude. Get the radio. See. It's not team speak. Keep off the radio. Hang on. Oh. We've been engaged. Contact, contact, contact. Helicopter. Helicopter is on its way back. Contact indeed. Right. Fire screen. Have fun. Soviet, I'm pinned. Copy that. Fuck are they? Moving up to you. Where the fuck are they? Uh, straight in front. I've got one. Now we seem to be clear of AI in the enemy in the actual compound. Got two. Any more for any more? Fuck me. Take a fire. Okay, I'm gonna hit it with a grenade. Stand by. Alright, I need bandage. Oh god. Oh, that's way too high. A bit better. Contact 320 short. AI engaging towards northwest. Uh, enemy, we're shooting at the hostile chopper MIA coming back right. Anyone got any nades? AI engaging helicopter, you should be taking it down soon. Still left a bit, did you? Fucking hell. Congratulations. We have to end this. I'm just slowing down a little bit. I'm not sure because I'm tired or because Tom pumped me full of more feet. Whoop. Fucking hell. Taking fire. Oh shit, Jimmy, look out. It's fine, it's a helicopter to keep a point. 
Fucking hell, fucking hell, fucking hell. Okay. Oh, no! Got fucking nailed. Thank you, Madman. Thank you. Fuck, we've said there was a... He'll... Contact South! Contact South inside the junkyard! So, are you alive? Roger, I'm alive, but hurt. Helicopter is coming for another strafe, over. Fuck. Okay. Right, we're mostly okay. Is it strafing us? It's doing something, what is it? Yeah, it's, it's got MGs live. Right. Let's engage. Civilians. Got one. Fuck! Are they allies? Yeah, they're allies. Shit, I just fired on a friendly. Must have been an NPC. Gents, be advised, some of us are now in the compound. Just uh, don't shoot at us. Over. Copy that, my bad. Hey, I just lost a medic. Social, is the north still compromise? Uh, we've got a contact far, about 500 meters on the opposite hill. Break, break, break. Gas coming on the road towards the compound. From the south. Gas south, roger. Fucking hell. Chopper's coming in, stand by, clear my back blast. Well, if he can make that hit. gonna try and make that hit. Firing! Ah, fucking missed, bollocks. Got enemy gas on the road, drove past. Goodbye. Fuck, he's still alive? He just took a direct hit with an anti tank rocket. Come on! Just hit it with a heat round. Thank you, Pie Jerky. Thank you, Pie. Cheeky bastard. Must be badly damaged. Gas dropped off enemies, southern part of the nice. compound. That's another one. Another chopper overhead. Looks to be a CSAT Orca. Christ. Tom's MG. Whoa. Getting lit up. That Kasatka setting down, it's got three. Enemy in my just gonna crush through. Fuck it. Thank you, Fire Spank. Thank you. Me touching down, full section of troops in. Roger that, engaging. Damn. It's gone down over the hill on 240 long. Can we get to it? Can we steal the helicopter? Potentially, yes. I'm moving up to it now. They'll never. Overpower the whole. I'll try to make for it as well. I'm not doing anything useful here. Shit. It's taken off. It's dropped off infantry. That's put a section on the ground. Section of infantry enemy. Fucking hell. Yeah, contact eyes on. Uh, full infantry team. More than a fire team. Shit. Right, take me full back towards us. Can you see him? Scratch one, falling back. See him. How's team two up there doing? Are you having full effect? Fucking hell, they don't like me. Oh, Jesus Christ, the MG. Team two, please respond. Watch yourself, Digi. Front and rear of me. I'm possibly going to go down shortly. 
Down to my last two magazines. Copy that. Maybe we can retrieve some shit. Damn it. Situation. Kill team in chat. Nice. Strafing us. Got no tube launchers left. Do you have a tube launcher? That's an IGLA. You all right? I've got a two uh, Right, I've got an eagle, but I got no fucking ammo for it. Right. That enemy heals coming back for another run. I'm gonna go check the corpses of the guys to the north, see if they got ammo and launchers. Copy that. I'll try and be oh, quick. Stand by. I've actually got one rocket in this igla. I'm gonna engage that healer as he comes Sweet. back over. Good luck. Watch this He's chat. Coming right now. Digby's gonna use an anti-air launcher. From south. Here he goes. Go on, Digby. Go on. Go on, Digby. Nail it. Nail it, Digby. Oh, shit. Beautiful. Right, so shall we push north then? Yeah, let's go and see if we can get the supplies. Alright, take up defensive positions in the compound. Except you two, you can stay there. Copy that. Fucking getting plinked from somewhere. So are we still pushing or are we moving to defend? Negative, our orders were to hold the hill. Uh, just find, trying to find ammo. Soviet, there's some ammo uh, by me. Uh, I'll come back up, show you. There's no more enemies nearby. I can recruit soldiers at the Fucking garrison. Hell. You can go come down to us. Taking shots from somewhere. Fucking. Someone's lighting us the fuck up. Uh, that'll do. Recruit all surrendered ones. I'll do that, I'll do that, I'll oh, do. Oh, fuck, they're mortaring. Fucking hell. Hill 2's lost. Fuck. Fucking hell. Gotta go, gotta go, it gotta go. To us, lads, that's accurate, yeah. your position. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You with me? Who's point forward? Is anybody down on that hill? Oh, sorry. oh god. I'm okay. Digi, one more, get the fuck out of there. Copy that. Go, boys, let's go. Oh, fuck. With pleasure. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Get off this hill before that next round lands. Alright, we've got some contacts bearing three. Three, two. Very long. Go, 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 go. They might be the spotters. Uh, three, uh, three, three, zero, sorry. There, yeah. Okay. Uh, very simple, Major. Uh, why military don't use shields in combat? Because uh, there's a, there comes a point where armor starts to become a bit of a trade-off. You reach a point where you apply more protection to the target, but the more obvious you are and the slower you move. Give a guy a, a shield large enough and um, sort of broad enough and thick enough to block bullets, well, you just become a large, fat, slow target to take more bullets. Same with visibility as well. The more armor you apply to one of your soldiers, the, the greater visibility is reduced when they could, for example, be able to spot that Claymore mine before they step on it, you know? Right. I'm alright. Okay, how are we doing? Yep, in modern warfare, mobility and concealment are vastly more important than armoured protection. 
Uh, and visibility, you know, the ability to spot threats. Which is why something like power armor what are we shooting at? probably won't really Be become advised, a thing. We have approximately five team size enemy advancing on us. Three, three, zero. Reference low stone walls on the ridge line over there. They're making a break for the low ground. Copy three, three, zero. See him. Very long range, very long range. Enemy contact somewhere southwest has been shot at. Fresh contact southwest. Trying to assist you, but my range is. I'm off to find more ammo. Thank you, Afton. Thank you kindly. Thank you, man. Alright, I've added five units to this garrison. They're now camped up in here. Nice. Thank you, happy lazy guy. Thank you, happy. I just need to check my RPG. Are we good to go? Fucking hell. Whoa. Uh, sh armored vehicle 160? Fuck! No, Patrol! Thank you, Vaden. 150 medium armored vehicle. Get some RPGs quickly. Roger that. Thank you, S3. Thank you, man. As do I. Watch the back blasts. Moving to assist you. Fell short, I think. That's the gas. That's light Fuck. skin. Shoot the gunner up top. Whoa, fucking hell. You shooting at me? Yeah. Thank you, Fedora. Thank you, man. Thank you kindly. Christ. Two kilograms. Is it not two kilograms? Got a shot out. What was the difference? Stand by, close to sort the vehicle. 18 kilograms. Then when I put the tube on, it's. Oopsie. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, he didn't have his. Wait, this is one of our guys? It's one of our guys. Who was it? It's Tom. Tom's body. Thank you, Tiger Storm. Thank you, dude. Okay. What the fuck was that? Thank you, Toby One. Thank you, man. What's the high there, Toby One? Ah, ammo. Good. Fresh ammo for the AK. Lovely. I can just uh, remove the wheel. Just watch for the dismount. What's that, Toby One? Uh, right. Just like an Ubisoft game, you don't want to spend money on me. Lost this is like a coupon. Proof. What the Twitch Prime? Charming, Toby One. Charming. But fair play, fair play. Thank you very much, Toby One. That's very generous. I hope you're well. Civilian. Thank you, Hi McFly. Thank you, Hi McFly. Okay, so now that we've taken it, good. Now we've got some. We've got a garrison here to try and hold it. So hopefully we won't lose it immediately. Sweet. So third time lucky, eh? Okay, hang on. Let's just uh, quickly repack all of my magazines while we have a moment. So it's a plan. Probably we've got a garrison right in this position now, so probably move away from here. Right, plan right now is to oh, look around the area. We're gonna try and take this gas, check for enemies. As soon as it's clear for 350 meters around it, we can get more people in the garrison. And we can keep it for longer time. We can go on for the mission. Copy that. So patrol around the surrounding area? Yep. Uh, a few people get into the gas. Copy that. 
Moving to the gas. Uh, yes, Dragonite. It's the same as a regular sub, basically. It's sort of subsidized by Amazon. I'm seeing shots 350. Gas coming in, it's us. I'm going to take it into the car and we can load it up with shit. Yeah. Be advised, shots 350. Thank you, Anthony. Thank you kindly. Thank you very much. Hey, boys. Right, we need a combat patrol going. Hey, going. I'm shooting at things. Oh, it's some. You're already on the gun. There's no gun. There's no There's gun. The, uh, oh, okay. It's a shame. Oh. Yeah, contact, contact 340. Yeah, on the hill. Fuck. Fucking hell. Nice. Is that Tom? Is that Tom with his MG? <laughs> it's Tom. Oh. Thank you, final. <laughs> nice. Uh, distance is fucked, I think. Nice one, Tom. I met past the tree line, having a look for them. Roger. Moving to you. Right. Moving to you, social. Guys, come with me to bearing 380, combat that patrol. Advised, yeah, I hear a helicopter. Oh, Christ, not another one. Yep, 330. Long. Thank you, Shadow Ruler. Thank you, man. Where's social? He's just in front of me over here somewhere. Social? Okay. Thank you, Ginger Ninja. Thank you, man. Cease fire on that machine gunner. He is brown bread. Just shooting at a corpse. It says that you, know, you can't recruit units because there's still enemies nearby. Copy that, we'll Copy scan. Do, do the surrenders count as enemies? Negative, don't shoot them. No, no, but truthfully, do they count? No. They do no, not. they don't, they I count as civilians. Alright, we need to spread out and look for the enemy then. Thank you, real snow kid. Thank you, real. Much appreciated. Thank you. So I'm just going to pop up this hill because this is where that helicopter team dropped off that group. Let's make sure they're all dead. Finish off any anyone that's that's unconscious. Two launchers are 7.6 kg. Are they? No, are they? Oh, right. Contact. Sorry, Two eight zero long on the road. Infantry. Thank you, laser dog. Thank you, dude. Moving around. Thank you, Fiatra. Thank you. Lost eyes, 280 on the road, medium. Where is he? Thank you, Paulios, for the compliments. Glad you like it. Where the hell is he? He was here, patrol. He was here. 
Am I going mad? Uh, our driver suspects he may have ran him over. Copy that. He says he ran something over and he wasn't sure if it was friendly or enemy. Yeah, we found him. We've definitely pancaked him. Roger that. Squad leader, uh, all the enemies dead. We just eliminated one. Doing that. Never mind. Like the contact eliminate. Mortifier. You kidding me? Mortifier. Oh, mortifier. Accurate, indirect. Spread the fuck out. Copy that. Out of the car. Spread. Oh, Jesus Christ! Right, men to juice the opportunity. One man's a waste of ammo. Spread out. Oh, wow. That was a bullet. That wasn't a. That wasn't fragmentation. I'm okay. I'm alright, I'm fine. Got it. Okay. Enemy contact, direction 35 on the hill. 35 top on the hill. of the hill. Zero three five, top of the hill, scene engaging. Engaging. Moving. Don't know why it's 3-5. Additional infantry, direct north. Oh there, I see him. Start shooting, yeah? Whoa. Ah, more infantry in the low ground. Uh, one zero zero at my current position. Oh, jeez, oh, fuck. fuck me! <gasps> God damn, that land is so close. My, wow, my limbs are shagged. Oh no, no, I'm gonna go home with purple hearts and get a wheelchair when I get there. Oh, my legs. Oh man, if I was standing up, I would have been mincemeat. Oh. Oh, I might die from this. Down the hill, relation to the gas. I can't hit the fucker and I'm out of Oh. God, if I was standing oh, up. Fuck. Jesus Christ, I'm in so much pain. I'm gonna pass out. We're morphine, rewarded. morphine, morphine, morphine. Get out of here. Quick, more morphine. Come on, come on. Open the medical menu. There is no medical menu. This is it. Alright. There we go. Fucking hell. Do I not have morphine? I'm out. Oh god, Digi's out. Tom, can you hear me? Fuck, my squad mates. Poro. Hang on, Poro. Hang on, I'm taking some of your morphine for me before I pass out in shock and then I'll pick you up. Oh, Christ. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go, a little bit more. A little bit more. There we go. That's enough morphine for me. Right, checking your wounds. Oh, it's bad, man. It's really bad. Hang on. Fucking hell. Oh, that hurt. Damn it, I'm hurt again. Oh man, man oh man. I think I might die with you, dude. We gotta get off this hill. Hang on, I've just gotta get enough bandages and morphine on me. Then pick you up and pull you down the hill. Need to stop your bleeding though. Okay, hang on, quick. Oh Christ. Oh, what the hell? Weird. Oh, the fucking eye flashes are hurting my eyes. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, there we go, bit of morphine. Fuck, this is it. Can you guys hear me? Right, hang on. Okay. Just need to quickly grab 
your meds. User in your channel time. Okay, off. right. You've got a major wound on your torso, poor. I'm just trying to get it patched. Okay. User it's, joined your channel. Your arms are shagged. Right, I'm gonna try and pick you up. You're not in. Right, hang on. So I'm gonna give you morphine to fight the shock. And then I'm gonna. Oh, epinephrine. Here it comes. Right, you might have to try and pick yourself up now. Oh no, you're unconscious again. Fuck. Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, trying out epinephrine again. You should be able to, if you stay still, you should be able to handle yourself. Nah, god damn it. Who's that? Who's next to me? Shinny. Cheers, Shinny. Yeah, you're you're alive? Yeah, surprisingly, I haven't took any hits. Alright, you patching him? Of course. Alright. Right, you do him, I just need to do do me. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, you do you. Yeah. Fucking Christ, okay. masturbator. <laughs> <sighs> okay, looks like this fat cunt needs some blood. Yeah. I'm quickly running out of that. Okay, I'm gonna try and sort out the others. Come on, where are they? I see somebody, who's this? Uh, okay, it's uh... Can't tell who this is. Check the dog tag. It's point forward. All right, hang on, man. Uh, according to this, I can't see any obvious injuries. Gonna give you epinephrine. You all right? No, he's unconscious again. Guess he needs blood. Jenny, point forward needs blood back here. Hey, Tom. Hey. Just trying to pick people up. Was Chinny working on these people? They've been patched up, but they're not. Hang on. Who's this? I'm picking someone up. I think it's social. It's social. It's social. So why are they not conscious? They've been patched up, but they're not conscious. I don't know. I don't know how to make them conscious. Uh, blood. Uh, but it's Chinny. He's the medic. Yeah, I don't think he has that. Oh, fuck. All right, I'm gonna make, gonna get him in the truck. Hang on. Just to protect him from the mortifier. Okay. Fucking hell. It's like, oh, fucking hell. Infantry moved up on us. Fucker. Uh, there is no medical menu as far as I know. It's just the ace. Oh. Are you still alive? Yeah, fucking got it. I'm alright. Shot in the head. My helmet Point took it. Dead. Fucking hell. Oh man, how much morphine have I fucking taken? Yeah. God damn it, we cannot hang on to this goddamn. Fucking hell. You got hit? Where are they? I see them, hang on. Opposite hillside, I'm bearing 3 0, roughly. Yeah. Hang on, there's one. Fucking. Oh, fuck! Someone moved up close. Oh, those are nasty headshots. Shit. Fuck. We're getting shagged here, man. My arm. One ball, four back to the compound. Take the vehicle. Copy that. Fuck. Bring it to me in port and we'll get him in. Get social in there, get him in. Can't leave him here. Oh, that's epinephrine. That's not heroin. Uh, morphine. Right. Mounting up. Yeah, yeah. I really hope this is bulletproof. I think it's bulletproof. You getting me in? Hang on. Can I unpack morphine from these? Yes, I can. Taking fire. Uh, you gotta like, hang on. It's like load patient. Put him down, put him down, put him down. Fuck me. No worries. Oh man. Are they allies down there? Yeah, we gotta go. Yeah, getting in. 
Is social in? Social's in, alright. Eric, I'm moving. So I see social, yeah. Where's Chinny? Chinny, where are you? Damn, Chinny's hit. Thank you, Skillo. Hang on. Uh, apparently, we just ran Chinny over. Uh, did we? Oh, okay, yeah, I see. Is this yeah, who's. Man. No, no. Damn, social just blurred out. Uh, yeah, okay, I, I, I found Chinny. Um, we ran him over. Is he lying? Uh, hang on. Let's check his dog tags. Hang on. Wait. No, this is Poro. Poro looks alive. No, no, I found Chinny. He looks alive. Uh, uh, no, no, he's, he's dead, man. I've got his dog tags. He's dead. Get in the car. He just died of blood loss. Let's go. Right. Uh, what's the plan now, lads? Hop in. I'm in. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. La, 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 la. Very. Uh. It's all right. Purple heart, big funeral, folded flag. He'll get it all. Well, his family will get it all. Um. Right. What are we doing? Are we bugging out? We gotta hold the. We gotta hold the thing. Oh. Let's stay here. We gotta hold it. Maybe. At least we've got full cover and we're off that bloody hill. Okay, we've got Digby and Point Forward coming back by quad bike. Right. Let's take the let's take the double story. Isn't it destroyed? Oh, is it, did it get destroyed? Hey lads. Hello. We're getting shagged here, but we still got it. We're still holding it. I see the enemy. What's the range of targets? Uh, where? On the hill? Yeah. 200 ish? 200 ish? Roughly. Oh, my ears! Did you <laughs> fire that right over my head? Yes, I did. You I fucking did. wally! Look, look at the enemy. You now. massive plonker! That's loud. Look at the enemy. I've plucked them. Yeah, <laughs> dude! Fucking spaz, you really are. I did, I did you favor, You're such a fucking that. dingbat. Don't, don't Fire a recoilless rifle right over a guy's head. Fucking. <laughs> ah. I fucking, I fucking killed him. Such a cunt. Um, so Chinny's dead up on the hill. Okay. Um, so we're still holding it though, yeah? We're doing okay. Yeah. Okay, hang on. The rest of them are back at the base, and social and vagrant are coming. Maybe. All right. They seem to be lost. <laughs> yeah, that, that'll happen. Right. Thank you, Epic L uh, J O One. Thank you, man. Now ignore the chat. Chinny's dead. Chinny's definitely dead, Digby. Okay. Yeah. He died on the hill. I have his dog tags. I'm gonna give them to his did, wife. Did Did you remove them while he was still breathing, or after he ceased breathing? I would like to plead the fifth. Okay. On that, actually, uh, I, I'm pleading the fifth. I, I I want my lawyer provided for me before I answer any further questions on record. Right. Okie dokie. I tell you what, as eh? both arms, um, I think we should probably just leave it here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's clear. Thank you, I am Stroud. Thank you. <clears throat> the mod is probably coming from the nearest AF RF base. Probably. So we've only got three yeah, men left here. The outpost has got the fire support sign. That one's 
there. So it could be there. Alright. I'm just staying here in cover. Already got shot to shit. I've injected fucking more morphine in myself than... I don't know. Who injects morphine into themselves? Herman Goering. Herman Goering. Really? Did he? He's an opium addict. How was he? Which is basically morphine. Yeah. I didn't know that. I knew he had the stick and everything. The staff that he kept pointing everything. Yeah, because he had the staff because he was involved in an air crash during the First World War. And it basically fucked his ability to fly and use his legs. Right. Um... So Thank you, Twitchy and Cannibal. Thank you. He just became addicted to it ever since. Yeah. Yeah. Right, we're just waiting for reinforcements. It's gone quiet now, which is nice. Falcon Actual, this is Chimmy. Uh oh. What's your situation, Oma? Who's Falcon Actual right now? He, do he doesn't sound very dead. Who's Falcon Actual? I guess it's me. Uh, Falcon Actual uh, over at the resource station. We're down to three men. The attack seemed to have ceased. Uh, we are waiting for reinforcements. What's your exact location, over? Exact location is grid 059201. Okay, welcome to reinforce, over. Roger that. Wait, I just gave him my coordinates. And we brought a mortar tube back to the base a short while ago. It'll be fine. And I kind of left him for dead up on that hill about ten It'll minutes. Be... Oh, I thought you said he died. We're dead. You know, column A, column B. Because he died and I left him for dead. I see uh, uh, infantry, pretty far. Thank you, Buddy the Hood. Thank you. Uh, bearing, uh, bearing again? 330. 330 far. How yeah, far away is far? Um, eight hundred. Eight hundred. Roger. Yep. Seen. Glimmer back blast. Thank you, Splinter. Oh God. Firing. Oh. And fucked. <laughs> the red man. One dead. Welcome back, Jenny. No. Oh, set eyes on second target. Clear back blast. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. What? Firing. A little bit pissed off then. A little bit pissed off. Peace, peace, one peace, one peace, one peace, one peace. One Chinny, one peace. One what? One what? Four will remember that. Ah, no, you don't. <laughs> what? I tried to save your ass. Poro. Oh. I tried to save Poro. I've got his dog tagged. I've got his dog tagged. Oh. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, you bastards! Clearly there's nothing that can be done here. Oh, you bastards! So now that we've reinforced, are we dropping more of a garrison here? Uh, I think that's the plan, yes. I'm currently going to... <clears throat> you know, I'd say, I, I'd say I've learnt my lesson, <laughs> but I really haven't. Because I'm a cunt. Can somebody give him one more FD? That's, yeah, that's, oh! Yeah. See, this is cyberbullying. That's what that is. This, this cannot be condoned. In fact, I'm going to report them. I'm going to report them to, twi to Twitch for cyberbullying. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Ark the Frenchie. Thank you kindly, dude. <clears throat> right. Uh, I've marked his triage as deceased. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's deceased. Right, back in the car, lad. Yep. Gotta be organised. Well, shit. Right, I'm gonna pour myself another drink. Anyway, uh, so cheers for watching, folks. Uh, for those who are in the chat right now, I hope you're having a lovely Saturday. So over here, the weather has been the weather has been beautiful in the United Kingdom. Uh, beautiful sunshine. Um, I spent a couple of hours this morning just in the park with Lulu, my French bulldog. Thank you, Sergeant Nibs. Thank you. Um, we just sat beneath a tree, and I had a book, and she had a chew toy, and we just relaxed in the sun. Um, Yes, and I'm, I'm just generally recharging my batteries after a difficult edit. That was the last YouTube video. And Monday, I begin the next one, basically. Um, yeah. How warm was it? I think it was like 21 degrees or something. With beautiful sunshine. Hello, Lulu. Hello, my darling. 
Right, okay. Should I get a beer? Hmm. Any teasers on what on what on what the next video will be? Uh, well, n uh, not yet. I'll will get to I'll get on that soon. Um, I basically gave a, a, a menu to um like a like a here's a list of all the footage that I have on my hard drive. Um, I gave it to my Twitch subs and my patrons along with a poll, and I sort of said, "What would you like?" And they voted and they decided, and I will start on Monday. Thank you, Max Down. Thank you very much. Yes, unfortunately, the last uh, bullshittery episode did bloat somewhat at 27 minutes. It took um, about 10 weeks of very difficult editing to complete. Um, yeah. And then before that, in January, I was doing some side projects that aren't related to bullshitteries. Basically. Madam Sun. Thank you, Madam Sun. Thank you. That's very kind. Thank you. How old is the French Bulldog? She is one year and ten months old. And she is plonked on the sofa behind me, probably feeling a bit warm. Right. Thank you, Dino Ducklin. Thank you, Dino. So, expect the next video to take at least ten weeks to be made? No, no, just... It takes me about three to four weeks to do a video that's ten minutes long. So... Ergo, a video that was 27 minutes long took much longer. Thank you, you watched M7, M8, M9. Thank you. Okay. Ten minutes want that ad revenue. Well, considering there is no ad revenue, Nora. No, I don't really give a shit. Right. Yeah, they're not going to pick me up, are they? What a bunch of bastards. Thank you, uh, Dregdor. Thank you, Dregdor. What happened to the Daisy standalone uh, rant? That is the side project, um, legit. So I sort of periodically, between bullshitteries, spend a bit of time working on some video essays. And they are, uh, there's ten of them, which will be combined into one video, and I've done nine of the ten parts. So the last part, last part needed. Right. So we have actually successfully taken the ammo dump. And we've got the power plant. Right. Thank you, Shifty God. Thank you, Shifty. Mortar. Is there a mortar tube in here? Is there a mortar tube in here? It would be very irresponsible for the team to leave a mortar tube within arm's reach of me. Very irresponsible, I think. Did it make it back to the base? Thank you, CT75. Thank you. Hmm. I don't think it made it back to the base. There's a tripod. What is that? That's not a mortar. Is it? User joined your channel. Uh, these are just NPCs running around. Uh, uh? Thank you, Stella. Thank you. Uh, no, wait. What's happened? 
People are DCing? Are they, are they ending it? No, I don't think it... No, I, I better not. I don't want to... I think we've only got like one of these. I don't want to fuck it up and... Hang on. So put it back in the thing. Right, uh, people wrapping it up. Hang on. Checking my messages. I've uh, got a few of them. Hang on a minute. Uh... So I'm just going to put this back. Right. Ba, 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 ba. Cool. And they're back in there, and then I go unload vehicle. There we go. No? Unload vehicle cargo? No, that should be it. That should do it. Two crates. Cool, I've added them back to uh, Arsenal. Awesome, okay. Uh, so socials over there. Yeah, so I think the guys are wrapping up then. How can I tell if they're still online? Uh, I'm just going to message them. Hang on. Alright. Okay. I think we're still going. Where are they then? What is that? They're in a gas. Oh, are they driving back here? Did, are they bringing the gas back? Okay, they're almost here. They're almost back to their quarters. Sweet. So I think they're bringing the gas back. 110. Nice, and then we can use it in the future. And helping out. There we go. I think they are. Are they moving down the road? Right. Ba, 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 ba. Just gonna wait here. Oh yeah. So uh, speaking to the chat then. Um, yeah. So we're just I'm just hanging hanging out with my mates on uh, Altus. Like three people to treat him. Hang on. Oh hi there, man. Yeah, I just crashed randomly. Ah, sure. Um, well, so three attempts to, to secure it, and I think we did on the last one, didn't we? Uh, yeah, we did. We have a few people there camped right now. Hmm. The thing is, though, that we couldn't still get more units there for some reason. There's still enemies nearby. Right. Oh, holy shit, the power plant was nine people in the meantime. Oh, Christ. All right. Yeah, I'm going to have to restack that. Oh, by the way, uh -huh. uh, we lost something. Uh, what did I lose? My dog tags. <laughs> 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 you bastards. I'll have those back. Thank you. Thank you, Wingroot. Thank you very much, dude. Uh, social systems commanders. I can't see it. Cool. He just says he's driving back, I think. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Uh. Oh, hang on. So the car shot him out of his seat and killed him due to a bug. User cool. left They're almost channel. here. Cool. I'm, uh, yeah, I'm probably going to wrap this up in a moment. and. Um, yeah, it's getting late. Yeah, I'm probably going to do a little bit of RimWorld and then go to bed. Thank you, CG. No. No. This is us back. Hey, they're back. Right. Woohoo! Success! Hey, guys, success. We did it. We secured it and we held it. Yeah, we did. Yeah, so um, we have to stack that with more AI now, right? Yeah, so, something like that. So if we were to, if we leave the server, like, will will that stay as it is with no one on yeah. the server? It will. Cool. Um, okay. You actually accomplish something. Yeah. Uh, social, can you go and resign as a commander quickly? Uh, yeah, can do. Um, <sighs> how do I do that? Okay, let's go. Uh, press Y, and then resign as commander. Is it possible for us to go after the uh, other guys, uh, outpost? Guys, guys, yeah. Chinny's pointing an RPG at us from over there. He can't kill us. We're just gonna wake up. And hey, Parrot! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Social. <laughs> Job done. The subordination will not be tolerated. Oh God! Oh no! Ow, my ears. Right. Uh, so, are we finishing up? Yeah, can do. Cool.
Cool. Yeah, cheers for the game, guys. I, I enjoyed that one. Um, no give me a poke if you're doing something tomorrow, but I won't be around in the morning uh, or the afternoon. I'll be around the evening. I learned so much. Um, yeah, I'll, to I'll totally be up for more. This is fun. Man. Right. Yeah, it's good. Like, we need to progress further, I think, though. We need to move on. You know, we can't just do the same same couple. Yeah. We need to get deeper into Altis. Yeah. I mean, look at it. I, I want to start, like, attacking the, you know, eventually. I want to get to the airfield and do that base and shit. Well, there's a, there's near Surtec, there is a uh, AA op that uh, is right next to a town that's more than that. So sure. We take that out. All right. Right, cool. Well, well, we'll sort it out later. Um, for the moment, yeah, yeah. Cheers, cheers for the game. Cheers. Right, I'm gonna bugger off and bugger off. Right. Okay. Returning to the lobby. Thank you, Battle Taco. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you. Um, right. Okay. Uh, oh. Do the thing that you said you were gonna do. Well, that's a lot of bad people. Alistair. It is. Oh, that's enough. Hey guys. Yeah, cheers for the game. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he shot me. What have you done? Oh, you're shooting each other. Oh, see, they can't yeah, everyone, everyone is dead. Oh, they can't hear me anyway. They're, they're still in the in the game, and it's just that I'm not in proximity with them to, uh, yeah, to uh, to hear it. Um, right. So um, I. Yeah, I'm not going to finish up right now. I'm going to, um, yeah, I'll go do a little bit more RimWorld, I think. So, um, yeah, just uh, thank you, uh, Battle Taco. Thank you, dude. Right, so I'm going to do some RimWorld. So I'll switch the game type. Um, I'm just going to get a drink of water and, um, and yeah, and just continue for a little bit more before bed. So, right, okay, changing the game type. So, uh, yeah, RimWorld is a sort of adventure game. Hang on a second. An adventure game set on the Galactic Rim. Hence RimWorld. Hang on, just changing the thing. Right. Ba, 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 ba. Is it going to save? Also, what's the dog doing? Ah, she's just sleeping on the sofa. Okay. Updating information. Closing armor. Ha. <sighs> ba 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 ba. Come on. So yeah, I mean, armor three, uh, generally, pretty good fun. But you gotta, you gotta kind of have a group group to play it with, you know. Hang on, might just terminate it. It's not closing. Okay. Come on, there we go. Updated. Yep, there we go. Saved Rimworld. Okay, popping out of there, going back to the ZFTS. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Thank you, Snowman. Uh, Snowman. Thank you very much. And before that, Zalada. That's very kind of you both. Thank you. Am I ending the stream, David? No, I'm just going to switch game type and just uh, play a bit of RimWorld for a bit. Uh, is Lulu well trained? Yes. It depends entirely on whether or not she sees a squirrel, though. Um, right. Okay. Then switch over to... Uh, nope, that's still in armor. I'm just gonna close it. I don't know why it's taking forever. Yep, close armor. Launch Rimworld. Hi, Yuki. Hello. Have I heard of a game, A Way Out? It might be another co-op game with me in sight. Yes, indeed. I'm afraid, however, it is published by Electronic Arts. And therefore, I do not wish to give Electronic Arts my money, so I will not will not be making that purchase. Right. How do we play Antistasi when we play on a public server? Do we play on a public server? No, it's a hosted so hosted one. Thank you, the three X Owl. Thank you, the three X Owl. Thank you. Right. Okay. Right then. Rimworld. Okay. So, uh, yes, for the unfamiliar. Uh, so, as said, Rimworld is an adventure game in which uh, you. It's Dwarf Fortress for those not familiar. It's Dwarf Fortress um, based well with a better UI. So here we are on this Rimworld here. And we have landed on this tundra, this ice sheet up to the far north. Uh, this this playthrough has been going for quite some time now, quite a few streams, and uh, we basically crash landed. Uh, it, well, the uh, a colony, a, uh, sorry, what my words this evening? A colonial 
uh, effort, so a colonization effort, was underway uh, using cryopods, but the ship that carried all of them exploded, scattering them in orbit, forcing people to basically crash land all across um, the continent here, splitting up family members and friends, not just through distance, but through time. For example, a daughter could crash land many, many years before their, say, mother and father to discover that they may be actually now biolog biologically older than their parents um, and like the leader of a bandit group or something. These skulls and crossbones here are bandit groups. Um, so yes, we've landed here at a place called Tundra Fall and, we have, and yeah, when we crash landed, we discovered no vegetation, no soil, no vegetation. It is ice and rock and gravel and polar bears. Um, and so we huddled around a hydrothermal vent and we tried our best to stay warm in the freezing temperatures. Uh, we tried to scratch a little, well, we had some basic food. We hunted for uh, any animals, migratory animals, you know, that were moving through as best we can. Um, for quite some time, we were scraping through on nutrient pace and also were forced to eat, eat the dead. Um, but thankfully, we're okay now. We've managed to build a um, quite well insulated um, facility here. Huddled still around that same geothermal vent, walled off this area here, where we're continuing to expand it. Um, it's currently the 9th of uh, autumn. Uh, each month has 15 days in it, and so the, yeah, we're good. We're good more than halfway now through autumn, and pretty soon entering the winter. It is minus 36 degrees outside, which is positively warm compared to the temperature that it will reach. So we're just trying to winter in Tundra Fall um, as best we can in preparation for next spring. Now. Quick introductions. Um, so we have Kaz, who is a 49-year-old former soldier and one of the original uh, colonists here. She is very stoic, very good in a fight, and very dependable. We have Ryoma. She is a 51-year-old mathematician, uh, does most of the artwork in the colony, such as the sculptures that help improve morale. She's also the wife of Yellow, um, the animal handler. We have Jen, the 24-year-old tribal child who handles most of the cooking. She's very naive and very sweet. Most people like her. We have Yellow, the 58-year-old animal handler and the husband to Ryoma. He's also quite frail. He has a bad back and uh, generally poodles around the colony. Pretty good in the fight, though. Quite useful. We have Shinderhans, the 30-year-old Navy scientist. She doesn't like anyone. She really doesn't like... She doesn't play well with others. She, gen she keeps to herself and um, gets annoyed by distractions with her research. We have Porter, the 41-year-old former bodyguard before he joined the colony. Um, he is pretty rubbish at most things. He's main, mainly a warrior, which is why we keep him around. He's a good, capable fighter. We have Mio, the 19-year-old... Uh, she was 17 when she first arrived in the colon colony. The 19-year-old extremely feisty and short-tempered teenager who's great in a melee fight. She's a brawler. She has a stat called Brawler. She frequently starts fight with people and she's put at least two colonists in the infirmary. But she pulls her weight just like Porter due to her abilities in combat. Gloob, an 81-year-old frail but sweet old old man who's very much the granddad of the, uh, of the colony. Um, unfortunately, he is getting on. Um, turn the music down. Is it too loud? Oh, sorry. I can see why. Because I've turned down my microphone. Sorry, I will, re I will restore my microphone to its previous volume. Yes, indeed. I turned down my microphone so you could hear people in armor better. Right. So... Gloobs, the 81-year-old granddad of the colony who helps with the mining, but um, he just probably doesn't have long left, to be honest. Um, he's trying his best. Space Mangoes, the 57-year-old Luddite and farmer who works in the hydroponics. Major Brain Damage, the 17-year-old teenage scared, frightened child, so that, that's his background, who mostly does janitorial duties around the colony. Vassal, the 30-year-old psychopath who's great with a sword. Vassal is also one of our primary crafters and makes most of our clothing and equipment. Dragoner, the 36-year-old 36 woman who is currently bugged out, therefore she has no specialization, but previously she handled the hydroponics. And Little Miss Hixie. Little Miss Hixie is an 18-year-old... What? Someone's missing. Who's missing? Someone's missing. Little Miss Hixie? Am I going mad? Um, Little Miss Hixie is an 18 year old uh, crafter, so she's joined the colony as a crafter. Someone's missing. 
Hang on a second. Am I just going crazy? Uh, checking the roster. Little Miss Hixie. Yeah, there's a blank spot. Who's missing? Where's Bitter Ritter? Yeah! Where's Bitter Ritter? What? Bitter Ritter's missing from this morning. Oh, right. Oh, fuck me. Oh, yeah. You're, sorry. Yeah, she's not appearing here because she counts as a prisoner because she's confined to quarters. She's confined to quarters because she went on a mental break and she was going to murder the animals, the alpaca that we have in the hydroponics bay. So we had to arrest her and stick her in her own room for her, well, for the benefit of the colony. She didn't resist arrest and she's confined there, but she doesn't count as a colonist until she's chilled the fuck out. Bitter Rissa has recently joined and we're training her to be one of our main builders. Okay, so problems, we have many. The animals are still, oh, ignore that. That's one of the huskies that we don't give a shit about in the, on the, yeah, the other camp that we have. Are the alpacas starving? No, they're okay for now, but their daisies are not being sown. Their food source is not being sown. Why? It's not clear. I need space mangoes to get off his laurels and go and, yeah, plant the daisies. Otherwise, the alpaca won't have food. Hmm. Okay. So we have alpaca in the hydroponics bay. Um, I need to build an additional hydroponics bay up here. Okay. Would I consider playing Fortnite for a bullshitter episode? Well, I, I generally just... I play things with the guys, really. I play things with the guys. Uh, a couple of them have played for Fortnite. I mean, they say it's all right. It's nothing to really write home about. Thank you, Speed Collector. Thank you. So, like, if they start playing it, then maybe I'll give it a go, but... Mm, not that fast. Right. Okay, so the colony is currently sleeping. It's four in the morning on the 10th of autumn. So we have five more days remaining of autumn and then we're truly into winter. Temperatures are going to fall into the minus 60 degrees outside. So, yeah, we better get ready. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Ginny. It was fun. Yes, indeed. Give me a poke next time you go in. Um, yeah, I'd like to do more. Right, okay, so everyone's sleeping. Food-wise, yeah, we're down to nutrient paste. Rice paste. Ugh pretty disgusting but it's better than starving our food reserves are not especially amazing we need to sow additional hydroponics okay thank you a uh, codeine syrup thank you right will i do a bullshittery on a total war game there's no plan sandstorm i just play whatever game and when funny things happen i note them down there's no plan Oh, really? Did Vern, Vern Troyer die? Hang on. Did he really? Oh, no. Is it, Ver, Ver, is it, it said Vern Troyer. Bugger. He dies at the age of 49. That's a shame. How did he die? Uh, Troyer died. He was battling depression. Oh, darn. Okay. I wonder if... Yeah. That sucks. Rest in peace to Vernon. That's rubbish. Thank you, Cataclysmic Karma. Thank you, dude. That sucks. Sucks indeed. Oh well. Um, right, okay, so the colony's waking up. So the teenager major brain damage is getting some nutrient paste. Okay. Bitter Ritter is confined to quarters. However, we should be able to let her go now. So, yeah. After breakfast, let her out and... Then she can go and get that sorted. Okay, major brain damage is awake and has started cleaning. Yellow is next awake. The animal handler. Getting some delicious nutrient paste. It's delicious and nutritious. Mm. They actually get a debuff from eating it. Look. So major brain damage has a 8 awful meal debuff of minus 4. So it's pretty awful, but you'll never get food poisoning from it, at least. Mainly because it's been boiled to the point of tastelessness okay so yellow is off to start his morning chores cleaning apparently you should be training the animals shouldn't you hang on where's yellow yellow here I've deprioritized you from handling the animals for some reason why have I done that I've assigned you as a hauler not sure why I've done that I've assigned Dragoner instead to handle animals Perhaps this is because Dragoner can no longer haul due to that bug. So Yellow is taking her place. 
Hi there, C4. Hello. Right, so most of the colony is awake now. Everybody's getting some nutrient paste. Yummy. Right. Uh, little Miss Hixie is disassembling a mechanoid. Um, madam, I rather need you in that room over there. Okay, I'm going to increase the requirement for doing this up to about 14 to ensure that only Vassal does that task. Yes, so I'd like little Miss Hixie, who is in training, to go into the drugs manufacturing room. Simply, out of coincidence, it's where, it's where we put the component assembly bench and manufacture components which are used in turrets. And we need turrets for our defense. I'm good, C4. I hope you're well. I'm good. Right. Thank you, Ethan. Thank you. Where is Vassal? So the psychopath Vassal is currently disassembling mechanoids. Fair play. So these giant centipedes are mechanoids, a synthetic life form that attacked the colony a short while ago. Good point. Bitterita's bed is... Oh, no. Hang on. Reassign this back to Bitterita. Oh, piss. Damn it. Right, so we got another beaver event back at uh, Morningwood. I sent Kaz here last time to eliminate some beavers. And we had to stay for a while because Kaz got downed. That's a massive pain. Do I have to send another pod back? This time with two soldiers. Hang on. So I want to try and eliminate the beavers and protect the wood supply at Morningwood. It's a, it's a camp to the south. So if I allocate them as hunting targets, right? Okay. Now if I did send a team back, a small team, two of them this time. If I did, do they have sufficient steel to make a pod and immediately come back? Yes, they could. Okay. When am I going to stop streaming, Hellcat? Ah, oh, when I get tired in a bit. I'll get tired in a, in, in a bit and I'll go to bed. Um, can I send a single pod that will contain two two of my warriors? Hang on. So if I sent Porter and Kaz... No. They're over the weight limit. Is that because they're especially heavy? Yeah, not. They're not yeah, super heavy. I mean, I could send lighter people. Thank you, Martham. Thank you very much. Take one or two turrets with me. That that could be a good idea, Alican. How heavy are the turrets? That would sort it out. But then again, I would need to set up a power source. Nah. Right. Um. Baka, 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 baka. Yeah, sure. I play with Sai. I play with Sai plenty. Right. Uh. Yeah. I I'm in a bit of a pickle here. I need to eliminate them. There's fewer of them this time. Fuck it. Let's just send Kaz again. I know that we might have a repeat of what happened last time. But let's just send Kaz. Right, Kaz. I'd like you to go into this drop pod. Here. So send Kaz. You've got a sniper rifle this time. And also, please load up um, a whole load of slate bricks. Uh, because they won't spoil. Uh, in fact, could you just take the steel with you? It's an easy way of get, getting the fuck out of there. Um, it's 80 steel, isn't it? Do we have any steel that we can just load into the pod? Uh, 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 uh. We do. Okay, just take 80 steel with you. Very bad idea. Kaz is going to... Well, I've got to do something and I can't send two people. I, I'm going to monitor the situation carefully. I'm going to handle it personally. Okay, hang on. And slate blocks for the rest. So make make the most of the space. Right, go. So the reason I'm sending Kaz is because Kaz is a former soldier, a very good shot. She has a sniper rifle, and also she's um, she's of sort of Spartan tastes in that um, she she's fine with living in in conditions that other people would find uncomfortable, and she's okay with eating raw meat. So she handles, uh, you know, nomad, well not nomad, but you know like a hermit lifestyle. Quite, uh, she handles it well. Why do I need to kill the beavers? Well, if I leave them alone, they will start eating through the trees. And the trees are one of the resources that I would like to preserve here at Morningwood. Because this forest, this boreal forest, is a source of lumber, which we don't have up here. There are, there are no trees up here. And we have gravel. Nothing, you know, 
potatoes grow, grow in that and not much else. Um, so, yeah, basically. Oh, thank you, Alistair. Thank you. Is Alistair finishing? Oh, darn. I wanted to host him up after this. Right. Welcome, Alistair's viewers. I'm just playing a bit of uh, RimWorld. Um, right. Okay. So, Kaz is off to get the steel. Where's she's going all the way up there? Okay. I was too slow, uh, says Novi. Oh, okay. Sorry. I, I did some armor and then I played this with the guy. Well, played did some armor with the guys, then I wanted to play this. KC6. Thank you, KC6. Thank you. Right. Okay, so what's going on? So, Kaz is getting in the pod. Ryoma's making works of art. Okay. Jen is. Right, so. What is what is Space Mangoes doing? Why are you hauling? Space Mangoes, you need to be Space Mangoes. Space Mangoes needs to be working on growing. I've assigned you to construction for some reason. Why have I done that? Handle growing, please. You're you're our primary grower. Um Who else can do growing work? Porter can, I guess. He's got some skill. But no, he's one of our main haulers. Uh, have him do it temporarily. Okay, so I've reassigned the work order so that Space Mangoes, our Luddite, and also Porter, the Psychopath, will start to plant hydroponics and also the... Um, what's he doing? Oh, he's, he's harvesting smoke leaf so we can make some marijuana. Um, cool. Right. Ba, 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 ba. Da, da. Novi, um, I sincerely apologise because this is something I probably should have asked uh, a while ago. Um, when it sorry, just well, you're just a name in the chat, so at the same time, whatever. Um, are you are you the brunette or the blonde of the two pictures of you and Gorty? Because I've seen because you sent me pictures of you you and Gorty, but then they weren't labelled, so I don't actually know who's who. <clears throat> Well, sorry, what I meant by that, Novi, is that I haven't met you, so I don't know. That's what I mean. So I've seen your two pictures, but they, they weren't labelled, so I don't know who's who. I've never sent a picture of me. Didn't you? Someone did. <laughs> sorry, that sounds dodgy. But I've seen pictures of you. And, and Gorty. You're the brunette. Okay, I see. Ah. Well, hello. Okay, I don't know how I got a picture of you then. <laughs> uh. I'm I'm digging a hole right now. I'm gonna stop digging and realize that I'm digging a hole. I'm gonna shut the fuck up. Right. Okay then. Uh, oh yes, we need to get this. Um, so we need to build these heaters over here. So Kaz is leaving. What's Shinden's doing? The Navy scientist. She's working on these sandbags. No, no, Shinden's. Can you work on this heater? The reason being, if we can get this room heated, we can extend, because this is gravel, you see. We can grow daisies and also potatoes in the gravel. Okay, do I have a list of the mods that I'm using? Yes, it's right here. None! Okay. I'm super confused. Sorry, are you sure you never sent me a picture, Novi? Because I've... Someone, someone did. <clears throat> right. So what's Kaz doing? Kaz is grabbing that steel. Yeah, you need to, you need to get, get your ass together, Kaz. We've got to go. You can't DM me on Twitter, can't you? Hmm. Yep, stop digging. Alright, yeah, yeah. Major break risk. So Shindahans is feeling very upset due to an ugly environment and the fact that she was insulted. Someone directly insulted her. It was... Mio. Ah, yes. Mio. Deadly, deadly little Mio. So Mio is our primary melee fighter. And she's also very, very... Yeah, she's a brawler, so she picks fights with people, big time. Thank you, Blue Seer. Thank you very much, Blue Seer. And Boo Hiskey. Thank you, Boo Hiskey. And Samtino. Thank you, Samtino. 
Thank you very much. Right, Kaz is ready for launch. Kaz, if you would like to go to Morningwood. Here we go. Right, so uh, you've got some steel and shit, so just land right here. Here we go. Right, so we've just launched a pod, which is now before, yeah, it's following a ballistic trajectory up into the atmosphere. Then it's going to come down, slow down, and land at the coordinates designated over at Morningwood. When Kaz lands, I would like her to get the uh, the pod ready for launch. Here we go. Kaz has arrived at Morningwood. Thank you, Araraxia. Thank you very much. Okay, she's here. She's off to hunt alpha beavers immediately. Before you do, young lady, could you please build a single transport pod here using the materials that you were just provided? Um, so the transport pod, well, you have to get components. Thank you, Boom Rain. Thank you, Boom Rain. There we go. So, okay, you can grab that tiny piece of steel there for some reason. You never got far enough in this game to get another colony. Going on foot is difficult. Indeed, which is why I used drop pods instead. Yeah. Kaz is not young. She's 49. Good point. Ba 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 ba. Okay, so Kaz, you will need to find components. You can find some in the nearby storeroom. What is me in the specific terms, Soviet? It's like this stuff is real to me. What do you mean, specific terms? No, I'm, I'm just narrating. A good streamer is a narrator for what is going on on screen. This is basically a radio show. The streamer is the presenter. The game is the music. Well, the games are the music. Um, right, so Shinderhans is current. Right, so what are you doing? You're currently holding steel. You're still super upset about Mia calling you a bitch or something. Um, man the fuck up. Yeah. Do people like Mio? Oh, surprisingly, people do. Little Miss Hixie likes Mio. Hmm. So does Dragoner. Space Mancos does not like Mio. Wait, it's because of. <sighs> Jesus, is she insulting everybody? She's insulting everybody. Right. Right then. Okay. Uh, that's the dog. That, that's fine. It's just a random husky that wandered into the area. We couldn't possibly take care of it. So it's minus fourteen, but we should be alright. Um, Kaz, could you? Oh, can I... Oh, you can't ever do hauling. Fuck. Well, it should be fine. Thank you, the striker. Thank you very much. Yeah, Kaz is just going to rest. Okay. Wait, does that mean you cannot refuel the pod? Tell me you can refuel the pod. Oh my god, I don't believe it. Thank you, Crytonra. Crytonra? Thank you, Crytonra. God damn it. Says you can't refuel the damn pod. Fucking fuck. Right, hang on. So we've got to send somebody else who can lift chem fuel and move it like fucking 20 feet into the damn fueling fuck okay so somebody else has to waste their time going over there so hang on so how much does how much does Kaz weigh wait hang on uh, mm. if I were to order her to yeah if I were to order you to load would you would you do it then like would you go ah I cannot go unless I fuel it let's we'll test it in the morning Thank you, Bl Blin uh, Blintzis. Thank you, Blintzis. Is this game hard on newer players or relatively easy to get into? Um, it's hard, but that's not a point in its. That's not a point against it. That's the whole idea. It's not holding your hand. Half the fun is figuring. You know, half the fun is getting attached to these characters and having them in difficult situations and having to make difficult decisions. It's not about building a colony and seeing it thrive. It's about the personal drama that exists between these small icons of different configurations of heads and and you know finding yourself surprised at how much character can be injected into these presets as it were thank you tipsy like for example in one of my previous colonies we had a situation where we ended up getting stuck inside the colony by a murderous pack of wargs which are like these wolves so we couldn't go out and harvest our crops so we were stuck inside the mountain and we couldn't leave thank you it's about nine thousand. thank you so with, without sufficient food, we had no choice but to eat our dead. 
And then, of course, some people started breaking because cannibalism, cannibalism has a bunch of mood debuffs. Um, and then there was an infection and someone's wife died. And so the husband, who was a soldier, went berserk and started killing all of the other colonists. And in the end, the only person, so the only person to survive the rampage was a, a sort of um, big sort of strapping nudist um, uh, guy, uh, artist called CJ, who was completely incapable of violence. So he found himself quivering and hiding in the storeroom as the soldier, whose name I can't recall, basically ran riot through the base with a shotgun and murdered CJ and all the other colonists until the only survivor was like a, I don't know, I think someone who's sleeping in a side room or something. And they were, st they were sealed inside a tomb base. You know, it's the random stories that, that come from all of these different r events rubbing against each other. Thank you, please. Thank you very much, dude. That's very kind. Right, Kaz has woken up. So, Kaz, if I were to, like, say, get in the pod, right, we'll now load... So, you, you just get in. Oh, you just get in and you don't give a shit as to whether or not it's fueled. So, I do need to send somebody. So, how much do you weigh... So you want 81, 81.8 kg. Okay, good to know. Right. So she's going off to hunt the alpha beaver. Right, that's fine. Hang on. <clears throat> so how much? She's only got five of them to hunt anyway. So it should be okay. Legendary crutch walker in Dwarf Fortress lost their legs to wear badges. <laughs> Shindens is as a major break risk again. Why? Oh, she built the heaters. Excellent. Okay, so let's put the cables over here. Right. Ah, ah, ah. Hang on a second. Right, okay. Right. Uh -huh. Yes, it's very good, Bappensy. It's very you, it, enjoy it. In fact, I strongly recommend not watching guides or anything like that. Um, just um, just jump straight in. Enjoy by doing. Okay. Right. So Kaz is off to hunt the beavers. Right there she is. So. Oh God, they've chewed through all look, that, that quickly. They went through all of those trees. Good. She's already got one. Shinton's failed to build something. Right. Good hit. Dies in 16 hours. Okay, leave it. Go for the other ones. That one's got a mortal wound. Okay. So right now she's just using a sniper rifle to plink them off. So there's one, two, three, four healthy ones remaining. So the reason I'm being cautious here is if we get the if we, if they uh, go enraged, we have to run back inside the base. Good kill. So is that the injured one? Fifteen hours until that one dies. You can ignore it. Go for that one. Oh, there's another one up there. You saw a dog that looked exactly like Lulu and a guy who had the same voice as me. You're going to talk to him, but you looked and you were and I was streaming at the time, said Spottycom. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Gunner. Thank you, dude. Well, bear in mind that Frenchies are an extremely popular breed. So, you know, there's going to be lots of people walking Frenchies. You know, there's like seven that I saw, you know, this weekend in the park. Yeah, it's exaggeration. There were there were like two that I saw in the park, but I know about like five of them on the on the regular. Okay. What's that? Sorry, you're on your first colony. Your one and only female is gay, and you have a priest that tries to date her. It's really tragic. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Car uh, Carvin. Carvin. Thank you, Carvin. Thank you. Nine hours till that one dies. Come on, Kaz. 
I was telling people that you're a former soldier and a great shot, but here you are. Ah, oh, Christ, he didn't even kill them. No, never mind. Uh, can you can you have kids in this game? Considering the top post on the Rim, Rimworld subreddit is that very question, can we can we have a patch that puts kids into the game? Uh, the ability to have kids. And then the next person down says, yes, more hats, implying that they're going to make human leather hats out of children that they're breeding. The next comment after that says, that's why you can't have kids in this game. It's a bit of a Rimworld meme. Human leather hats. Can you imagine that if it, if it hit mainstream media? A game that lets you have kids and then harvest them for their leather. <laughs> Hang on. Come on, Kaz. Okay, back at Tundra Fall. Uh, we need to replace that pod. Okay. So. Damn. There's no way we one pod can get the... Uh, ca so Kaz is, Kaz is super heavy. We're going to need two pods to come home. Fuck it. We'll send enough resources to build two, yeah, the second pod. Right then. Looking good so far. Okay, hang on a minute. So, of the people that remain, let's... Um, so, who should we send? So, this pod here. We'll make sure we send... So, someone who can haul. Thank you, Proggy. Thank you very much, Proggy. Thank you. Um, what if we send Bitter Attack? And then she can build stuff while she's there. Well, no. Send Porter. Just send Porter. So, send Porter, and then with him... Send sufficient resources to build another pod and get the fuck out of there. They should have sufficient fuel. Okay, so it's 80 steel. Thank you, Potato Bergenson. Thank you, Potato. That's most, most kind. What's that beard, man? You had a minor accident on the on in your car? Shit. Bugger. Sorry to hear that, dude. How's the car? Is it is it minor? Or is it like, I don't know. I don't drive myself, so I don't know how it works. Unfinished components. Hang on. Uh, where, where are the components? Am, am I being blind? Unfinished component. Do I not have regular component? Oh, fine. They've got components over there. Should be all right. Um, all right. Fill up the rest with slate blocks. Yeah. There we go. Here we go. I don't have any. Oh, I see why. Vassal started working on the power armor. Right. We've used up all of our... Yeah, we've, we've used them all up. Okay. Right, so the two more badges. That one died. B badges? Beavers. No, we've got them. That's it. You can stand down. They'll die of blood loss. Stand down, Kaz. Very good. So there are two more beavers and their wounds are mortal. Uh... Yep, leave it. Stand down. Thank you, Cyanide's Perfect Form. Thank you very much, Cyanide's Perfect Form. A mad animal. A local alpha beaver has gone mad. Well, it's one of the mortally wounded ones. It'll die in five hours' time. Yeah, just shoot it before it gets too close. Position yourself here. Where is it? Oh, no. It's, okay, it's passed out. It's lost too much blood and it's passed out. Never mind. Fucking beavers. Right, okay then. So, Kaz. Yeah, if you could just... Uh, well, there's stuff to build around the base. There's dresses and... Yeah. Just, but, so, uh, for, yeah, for, for the unfamiliar, I'm basically making a sort of farming base to be occupied during the warmer months to send food back en masse to Tundra Fall. Okay, so Porter's ready. Porter, yeah, if you could please head down and join. There you go. And build a replacement pod. We're running low on chem fuel here. We're going to need to dig out more from the ground. Chem fuel. Ah, shit. The power to that mining thing was severed. Uh huh. Should I remove on the, the roof on the second base? Yes, that's a good idea, actually. 
Yes, before we leave, let's remove the roof. Uh, this is because in the event of a fire, the rain will put it out. Thank you, Nobi. Insert message about wanting to get out of the dungeon. Maybe at some point. Thank you very much, Nobi. Why did the bedrooms look, look like a maze? Yeah, it just looked, looked interesting. Oh, oh, okay, right. At Morning Wood, a military commissar named Darcy Cooley calls, from, calls me from nearby. She's being chased by pirates from the Shadow Fists. So they are, the, they are proper pirates, they're not tribals. She begs for safety and offers to join the colony. She's 33 years old. Be warned, if I accept, I will have to fight off the pirates on her tail. Thank you, Mint Squirrel. Thank you. Now, Morning Wood is not in a position to defend. However, we do have two capable fighters here. And also, if we're fast enough on building the pod, we could just build the pods and get the fuck out. The question is, can we refuel the pods fast enough? Thank you, Faron. Thank you. Honestly, I think the answer might be no. I don't think we should accept. I think we should decline. What does the chat think? So this is Morningwood. This is the camp. The lumber camp. People think we should do it. Lots of people are saying we should do it. Thank you, Hexeter. Thank you, Hexeter. Yeah, I don't think. I think both of. I think. Mm, I think both Porter and Kaz have sniper rifles, though. Not necessarily the best if we get bum rushed in melee. Thank you, uh, Yoshi Mops. Thank you, Yoshi Mops. I don't think we should do it. Hmm. Then again, she does need help. Alright. Fuck it. Let's give it a go. We'll give it a go and we'll try and see what happens. No guarantee of success, but we'll try. We could lose both Kaz and Porter. Or we could succeed. We'll try. Here we go. You ready? Right. Here she comes. She's a capable fighter. Good at p Potentially good at cooking. Right. Quickly run over here. She can also haul. So, run here, grab a weapon. Okay, Porter. They've both got sniper rifles. Also, wide open area. We could gun down the bandits with snipers. Kaz, then. So, what's Porter doing? Refueling. Yeah, hurry up and refuel that. Start moving quickly. Thank you, flashback. Thank you, flashback. Right. Kaz, start working on the transport pod. Okay. As fast as he can. Let's see how bad this is going to be. Where's there she is? Honestly, I don't think we have the time. We're gonna to have to fight. Porter's running in to get the cap. Here comes the raid. It's not not good, but it's not it's not bad actually. Right, the Uzis, one club wielder. Right, I think we can do it. We just need to be a bit strategic. So Porter, quickly go here. Kaz, go here. Cooley, you're going to have to grab a weapon to keep moving. Don't stop. Is there an option inside the base for you? No, not right now. Right, so to our benefit, they only have one melee guy and they've got a lot of open ground to cover. So Porter, move here quickly. If we can eliminate the guy in open ground, our snipers will give us a real advantage. Thank you, the real Mitchell. Thank you. It's a risk. Here we go. Let's give it a go. Here we go. Kaz is ready. I eliminate the melee guy first. Okay, they're slow moving over the marsh as well. Look. There we go. Go for him. 
Keep moving coolly. Porter, you too. Straight to the melee guy. Okay. Keep moving. She's got too far to go to get a gun, I think. There we go. Take him out quickly. There's another melee guy. Okay, how's your... Right, I'm going to intentionally throw her at Spider over here. Tie him up. Keep, keep him off the sniper. But there we go. Right now, sniper, focus on this guy with the assault rifle. Both of you. Porter will need to take cover in a minute. Okay. Right, Porter, move back and take cover. Right, both of you now, just melee, do, yeah, melee down this dude. Okay, melee him down. There we go, headshot. Now melee. Okay, Porter's still okay. Right, Porter, go... For that one. Come on, come on, come on. How's he doing? He's severe pain. He's almost down. Come on, come on, come on. We're okay. Porter's taking a hit. Machine gun straight to the torso. Right, that one's down. Right, grab his shiv. Kaz, move here. It's a hard cover. Coolly move around here. Porter's still in hard cover. Right, Kaz. Go for this one because she's out of cover. Gonna be close. Good kill, Porter. Well done. Can I take the shot? Good hit. Shit, Porter's hurt. Severe pain and will die in 17 hours. Pull back, Porter. Okay, keep firing. Keep firing, keep firing. Shit, not good. Kaz is now in the open. Fuck, pull back. We just need to make another good kill, I think. Kaz pull back. Make, just make a good kill and they'll flee. God, oh, fuck. Come on. Kaz, you've got to make a kill. Someone's got to make a kill. No. Yes! There we go. They're, they're fleeing. It's over. Right. We did it. Let's have a look and see how bad. Right, so both of our main fighters... Shit, we all pretty much... Yeah, we're, we're all, we've all got mortal wounds. Not good. So, do we have... Somebody capable of performing medis uh, medical procedures. Uh, characters. No. Nor do we necessarily have the meds. Right, so. We've got to send addition. Damn, we're back in the same position that we were a moment ago. In that we've got to now send. We've got to invest. More I, I sent Kaz over here to deal with some damn beavers. And now we're going to get invested and tied up here again. Um, so, you know, we've got to send over medical p personnel. And, um, you know, that's going to require more space in the pods, which, you know, fucking requires more resources launched over. It's back and forth and back and forth. But, yeah, at least we've got new colonist. At least she's okay. For now, she'll die in six hours if she doesn't get medical attention. Yikes. Okay, right. So, stand down. What sort of medicine do we have on site? Medical do a home visit, yeah. Okay. Right, so who can we... Say? Right, Ryoma would probably be why. Psycho... No, wait, she needs cocaine. Uh, yeah, yo. What about Major? Major might be a good choice, actually. Okay. Right. So, yeah. Major. So, Major brain damage. Um, yeah, you're going to have to get in there and take some medical supplies with you. Uh, take... Yeah. Out, so... Uh, major... Brain damage. Just take the herbal meds. We don't have time to grab uh, like an, another full stack. Okay. Right. How about sending the new colonists home? Uh, well, we didn't refuel it. What do you mean? Hang on. Did we refuel it? No. I see what you mean. Send her. Send her first. Hang on. Can Porter refuel it in time? He dies in 16 hours. It's a gamble. Can he get sufficient fuel in there before he passes out? Can he get sufficient fuel in there? He'll, he'll need, it'll be two runs. Can she haul? But she'll die in six hours. And she's got hypothermia. We'll do both. We'll do both. Well, yeah. Well, we need to do both anyway. Right, so. Fuel that up. 
You just get into bed here. This is now medical bed. Okay, Kaz. You get into bed here. Okay. Major. Yeah, follow my orders as specified. So, Major, the teenager. Wake up, fill the pod, and grab a single stack of herbal meds. Okay. Major is now waking up to do that. Here we go. I can self tend. No, it'll take too long, and their skills too is too low. Very little time, indeed. Very little time. Uh, hang on. Can two people be sent? Any combination? No. They're just too heavy. Only one person. There's a seven stack of meds. I put seven in there. Indeed. Yes, indeed. That's correct. There's no time. There's no time to stop the bleeding. Oh, shit. Damn. That's going to complicate things. He's trying to cut his way through the base. Uh, Kaz, just open the door for him. Don't get in his way. Move out of the way. Don't get in his way. He'll engage you. Nope, don't do that either. Just get to bed. Let him move through. He's moving through, you see. That way. Right. What? No! It's, oh, it's, it's that one. She... she yeah, she passed out. Okay. Get her into a bed. Dies in 5 point... Yeah, 5.2. It's going to be close. Okay. Major's moving the pod. Porter's coming. That won't be enough fuel. He needs to do a second trip. He dies in 15 hours. Okay. Okay, Major's almost made it. Ooh, I just had an idea. Grab some... Yeah, hang on. Ah, yes. Okay, hang on. I've got an idea. Cancel that. Major. Because it's right next to you. Chem fuel. Um, right, so... Major... Uh, 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 uh. Sorry, what, what am I doing? Um, Major is up here. Okay, and then... Items, that seven stack of herbal medicine. Right. And then chem fuel... 150. Uh, yeah, actually, just just stack. Um, so 100 and 150 will be uh, actually do. Um, two, 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 five. Okay, because it's right here. You can hear Lulu fapping in the background. Yeah, sorry, she's licking her genitals. Right, yeah, just grab it quickly. Right, Kaz is going to bed. She dies. Here comes Porter with the first load. Okay. Load it up, load it up as fast as you can. She has no right leg. Yeah, I know, Major. Well, not about the right... Sorry, I wasn't watching the right leg thing, but I know that she's got to get to, quick, to medical attention quickly. That's what we're trying to do. Right, uh, Ryoma... Could you... Well, not yet, almost. Wait for it. She's 3.6 hours. Okay, Porter's... Okay, damn. Didn't grab the whole lot. All right, never mind. Move into your bed. Okay. No time for fuel, do you reckon? There's got to be time for fuel. You didn't bring enough. When I put the fuel to cargo, put it to maximum, uh, but only need 50% for the distance. Uh, I don't know. Oh, oh, sorry, would it use 100% anyway? I don't know, I'm afraid. But I know that I do need to make max distance because it's, like, it's exactly 150 tiles away. Thank you, Marauder's Check. Thank you very much. Three hours remain. Okay, Major, you better hurry. That's going to have to be the last one. Not good. 
she is going to die in 2.5 hours. Two point three hours, Major. Uh, could you be a little bit less glacial? Oh Christ! Nah, she's toast. All right. One point nine hours. No, 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 no. Oh, no, now I've got to unload. Fuck, no. So there's not enough chem fuel nearby. He has to go for that supply there. Oh, shit, no. So I have to do that and cancel. And then reassign it. There's not enough time now. All right, hang on. So major. Sorry, how much is there exactly? 195. Fuck. So it wasn't all stalled there, you see. 195. There we go, he's in. Right, okay, launch. Right. Right through the ceiling. Can he save her? 1.3 hours until she bleeds out. She's lost her foot and it's bleeding a huge amount of blood. 1.1. One hour. It's now Her life is now measured in minutes. Okay, Major, the teenager, has arrived in the freezer. Okay. Tend, grab. 0.63 hours until she dies. No, 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 no. He's taking too long. Damn, no, she's... I'm making a call, she's dead. Okay, save them. Yeah, save the, med, the meds for our... Yeah, she's, she's gone. All right, start working on Porter. Where are you going? No, don't don't grab that one, dude. Right. She's gone. Okay, so at least Major can haul. He can haul. Yeah, he can fuel up the pods. And uh, yeah, need to go. I just doomed her. Yes, I did. I made a call. Okay. Yeah, she's gone. Right, goodbye, new girl. Fuck. Everything we risked. <laughs> you okay? Lulu's flopped on her back because she wants a belly rub. You want a belly rub, my darling? Mm. You're a good girl. Yes, you are. Yes, you are a good girl. Okay. You could have saved it. Nah. So that was one. So that 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 was one single injury. He was patching up. See. The bar is for each injury that they've suffered. He says, and then he did multiple. Weird. Right, ten to Kaz. Right, one, yeah, see, look. Okay, multiples then. No, I, I, maybe. Maybe I could have saved her, but too late now. Okay, he's off to eat. Kaz is on her feet. Okay, Kaz, sense of urgency, you need to get the trans transport pod up. Okay, major brain damage, get it fueled. Yep, there we go. Let's go home. Okay, and the other one. No, 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 no. Okay, Porter has left his bed to go on a sad wander due to his injuries and the fact that he's hungry. And Space Mangoes and Jen are now fighting in the hallway over some potatoes. Ugh. Who started it? Insulted Jen. Okay, so Space Mangoes, the Luddite, insulted Jen. The two of them do not like each other. Why? Oh, hang on, because Jen harmed Space Mangoes. Oh, just a moment ago or before. Not sure. Regardless, Space Mangoes is talking shit. Uh, so a Luddite is talking shit to a, a tribal uh, or oracle girl, and, and the two of them are now fighting. Okay. Oh, they've ended their fight. That was fast. Jen 
doesn't have a scratch on her. Space Mangoes is in severe pain with bruising all over. You did start it, mate. She just sat your ass down. Get into the infirmary and think about what you've done. Well done, Jen. Right. Right, Porter's gone for a sad wander. That sucks. Hopefully he doesn't get an infection. Right, okay, so at least we have escape help. So if I were to order the evacuation of the whole thing, yeah, so there's still sufficient weight for Porter once he's got once he's gotten shaken out of his whatever it is he's doing. Um, okay, light that up. Right. I'm just going to leave the corpse in bed, yeah, for now. Thank you, Matty the boss. Thank you, Matty. And World Slater. Thank you, World Slater. Refuel the generator. There we go. Power has been restored. Major is now cleaning. Right. And you can close the door now. Yeah, get, get this cleaned. Three major break risks. Ryoma, Kaz, and major brain damage. Yeah, we weren't expecting it to be a long stay. Bury the body. Yeah. We'll dig a grave out there. Kaz, can you do that? Okay. Extreme break risk, Ryoma. What's the problem? Psychite withdrawal. She needs drugs and we don't have any. Sorry. We've got none growing as well in the hydroponics. Not much we can do, Ryoma. Sorry. Okay, a grave has been dug. Major, um, yeah, get her buried. It's the least we can do. So there goes Cooley, the military commissar, buried in the uh, soil of Morning Wood. Okay. Uh, that's okay, Major. You don't need to clean that area. We don't necessarily care about that insofar as cleaning is concerned. Nor that. Nor that. You don't need to clean that. Just leave it. Okay, well, at least we eliminated the... Uh, yeah, we took out the beavers. Hooray! Okay. Right. Cleaning rubble. Okay. Right. Do they have any guns worth scavenging? What's that there? A chain shotgun. Yikes. Nah. Leave them. Okay. Kaz is just keeping busy. Porter is suffering from malnutrition. Okay. Starvation, Porter. Yeah. Okay, I have the time to remove the roof. Yes, indeed, but we'll try and do that, do that as the last thing before we leave. Third pod? Could do. Could prove useful. Like, you know, if, it, if, we, if we're having a repeat of the beaver incident. The door is still open. Yes, it is. I believe it's blocked by that shiv. A mad animal. A local snow hare over at Tundra Fall. Also known as dinner. Okay, the turrets are active, I believe, running off the geothermal vent, and we haven't put the switch in yet. So snow hair, snow hair is dead in three, two, one. Ah. Oh. Cool. Dinner served. Extreme break risk two. Uh, both Ryoma and major brain damage. Although thankfully they're sleeping, so they can't break while they're asleep. Thank you, hat ready. Yes, it was back in July, I believe. Oh no! A glitter world surgeon! Wow. 
named uh, Genio is calling for help. This is ah, this time it's different. So this time, it's tribes people, and it's at Tundrafall where all of our defenses are active. A 41-year-old surgeon is calling for help near Tundrafall. Shall we respond? Now most most well, Kaz and Porter are away. Two of my soldiers, but we do have the turrets. The, the turrets are ready. Well, most of the turrets are ready. And they are tribals, so bows and arrows and sticks and shit. We have lost Maximo, our main doctor. Calling it now a raid of 40 people? Probably, yes. Yeah, I say we go for it. Right. Here he comes, Junio, a 41-year-old. Uh, an annoying voice. Oh, God. Okay, this colonist is not half as good as I was expecting. They don't even have a burning passion for medicine. Ah, uh, And they're crap in combat. Bollocks. Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. But at least they're coming in from a favourable direction where the turrets are mostly ready. Alright, get on in as quick as you can. Um... Do we have any HE? We do have HE. Uh, let's get the uh, mortars loaded. Need to put a minefield down with some of these. Right, hang on. Pop the shell out. That's fine. Right, people are sleeping, uh, but time to wake up. Um, Jen. Yeah, low, yeah, get. What's the temperature? It's minus 47 outside the base. Thank you, jump base. Thank you very much, dude. Thank you. Right. So, a uh, yellow, wake up and bring your pulse rifle. Shinderhuns, bring your minigun. Okay, Mio, bring your thrombo horn and also evacuate that dormitory. Gloobs, you just stay asleep because you're an old man. We need your rest. Space Mangos is in the infirmary after that fight. But your injuries are superficial. Oh, fine, you're a non-combatant anyway. Vassal, bring your sword. Uh, Dragoner, where's your gun? Not sure. Uh, oh, Poro's sending sending me messages. He, he called, he's, he's investigating some of the stuff that we were doing. Uh, hang on. Uh, whoopsie. Dragono, if you could please move and grab this assault rifle. Uh, okay, who else? Incapable of violence. Incapable of violence. I need mortar operators. Um, we'll have Vassal and... Uh, I need people who are bitter at it. Can you do it? No. Little Miss Hixie, now you're incapable. Goddamn pacifists, now is not the time to have a crisis of conscience. The people are coming to eat you, basically. Right, get the turrets enabled. Prepare for an incoming tribal attack. Okay. What difficulty am I playing on? Extreme. Here we go. That's not too bad. Should be fine. Oh, he's too slow, though, and they're faster than he is. So we might not even get the damn colonists. Right, okay. Vassal's got an HE shell loaded. You're free to fire at the earliest opportunity. Go for the front lot. Thank you, Aryanus. Uh, Ar Aryanus? Thank you, Aryanus. Thank you very much. Right. Can we get these turrets on, please, folks? Don't just stand there looking at them. Oh, Christ. Dragon, you just get get on the mortar. Thank you, official Stammy and R. Arnia. Thank you kindly. Right, Shell is going to be fired in eight seconds. Thank you, Fawn Kumul. Thank you very much. Right, turrets are now live. Yellow, move. Yep, move here. Shell away. Bollocks. Missed. Dragon is also loading HE shell. Oh dear. Right then. They're closing. There's lots of melee there. Very, lots and lots of melee. This could be difficult. Hang on. I'll need Vassal for this. Okay, fire just a couple more shells and then leave it. Here we go. Good hits, well done. Damn. 
Right. Vassal abandon. Move to the yeah, move to the main front. Dragon, you can keep firing so long as you're careful and you go for an archer. Here we go. Open up. Don't hit the surgeon. What did I just say, turrets? Oh Christ, Junior, move out of the way. Right, we're opening up. Pour it on him. Fuck, he's downed. Come on. Melee closing on us. Right, Vassal moved down to assist Jen. That's gonna blow. Took out a bunch of them. Took out more. It's almost over. Got another one. It's over, they're fleeing. Right. The surgeon has serious hypothermia because he's naked in minus 49 degrees. Get him into the infirmary and fast. Waste the remaining tribals. Thank you, True Taquito. Dragging a stand down off the gun. Right, very good. Stand down. Stand down. We lost a couple of turrets. It's fine. Replaceable. Right. Thank you, Mr. Holt. Thank you, dude. Who's that there? One of them survived. Dies in 4.7 hours. Uh, a v v vassal, you missed the surgeon. It's th th that's the wrong one, vassal. There's a, there's a surgeon here, vassal. Right here, vassal. Uh, there's a, there's a surgeon, vassal. You might you might want to hang on. Uh, over here, yeah, that one. Yeah. <clears throat> Shut up. Sh yeah, quickly, just get him into the infirmary. Quickly, as fast as you can, Vassal. You're, you'll be okay, Doctor. You'll be okay. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. You gotta hurry though, because they'll die in 4.9 hours. Um, Ryoma is awake. Oh, mood is really low. Do we have any psychite at all? Um. No, God, our main doctor needs drugs. We don't have any. Um, do we have anything we can give you to improve your mood? Uh, some, uh... Right. No, not really. She's gonna immediately. Oh no, hang on. This this psychoid tea. Oh, one of the tribals. Oh, did you, you you don't have time to drink it. Ambrosia, what's that? Uh, there's no time. You've got to save the, the surgeon. Thank you, Templar. Thank you very much, Templar. Thank you, dude. Severe illness, I know. Oh, no. Um, that's just a tribal. Um, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Right, quickly. 3.5 hours. You don't have time to grab the meds. Just, just try your best, Ryoma. Already doctoring. Yep, go for it. Quickly. Ryoma has an extreme break risk. That's the problem. Okay, how are we doing over here? Porter has... P Porter finished. Are we ready to leave? Uh, yeah, we're ready to leave. Hmm? That's my cot... No, no, no. No, no, I don't know what you're talking about. Um. See, th th this is my colonist here. This, this, um, tender. With eight... Skill in medicine and a burning passion for it. This is just a tribal guy, yeah. Ah, with an annoying voice and 10 skill in medicine but barely a passion for it. Right. Welcome welcome aboard, Mole the Doctor. It's an odd name for a surgeon. Those glitter world doctors. Okay. Extreme break for his Ryoma, yeah. Okay. Cool, Vassal's still working on that power armor. 
It's going to take some time. Oh. Okay, uh, so sorry, based on the time actually, it, it is quite late, it's just gone midnight, so I probably do need to wrap this up. Um, right. Oh, hang on, the power got severed to the mining drills. Better replace that. Also get the furnace on so we can start torching some of these corpses. Yeah. Get the supplies indoors. Okay. Yes, indeed. Don't forget to take the roof off this other place. Yes, indeed. Good idea. Um, right, so. Ignore roof area. So start unroofing this. The reason being the furniture will not deteriorate. And... So hang on. Oh, no. Sorry. I need to actively specify that it's a remove roof area. Yes. So the furniture won't deteriorate, and exposed to rain, the base will be better protected from fires. Okay, so yeah, remove the roof. And someone power down the generator. Don't you get a debuff? Yes! What, by letting the surgeon die? Yes, we do. Extreme hypothermia. Because he's naked in minus... 44 degrees. Take care, Wolf. Thank you. And take care. Oh, a tribal died. Stick him in the furnace. Yellow, could you stick him in the furnace? Oh, hang on. One of our dogs is taking a quick bite. Yeah, yeah. So Brunhilde is just uh, chewing on a tribal there. And it's... Is that because we lack kibble? We lack kibble. Bit off his left leg and his right foot. Yeesh. Hang on. Oh no! No! Ryoma had just gone berserk through lack of um, of, of uh, Yayo. She saved the bandit though. The the, tr the surgeon. Right. Okay. We gotta. Right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna apprehend Rioma, and then we'll I'll finish up the stream. So hang on. Um. Uh, shit. Whose bedroom is it gonna be? We have insufficient bedrooms right now. Well, hang on. Where's Kaz? Kaz's bedroom. We can give up for the minute. No. Oh, that bedroom there. Um. Sign that as a prisoner bedroom. Right. So where's Mio? Mio, come over here. Where's Vassal working on the power armor? Come over here. Drop your. So these are my top melee guys. She's attacking. Bounce of the dog. Okay, hang on. Bitterito, get out of the way. Vassal, drop your sword. Take her on without your melee weapons. You too, Mio. Now she's atta attacking one of the alpaca. Right. Apprehend her, please. Can we. No, we can't arrest her. Just melee her down. Right, so Ryoma, our mathematician, has gone berserk through lack of yayo, cocaine. So melee her down. And get her in the infirmary. Thank you, Skeeter. And hi there. Don't beat up the alpaca. Come on, punch her down. There we go, she's down. Well done. Grab your weapons again. Okay. And Gloobs, could you please get Ryoma into the into the infirmary? Right. Okay. So um, yeah. So well, I'll leave it there for now. So uh, thank you, Kibai. Thank you very much, Kibai. So yeah, just playing a bit of um, the Tundra playthrough. We just defeated another raid. We just had uh, troubles over here in Morningwood, which is the name of our um, farming community further south. We're trying to evacuate it as best we can. And before that, I was playing some Armour 3 with the guys and, yeah, hanging out for the evening. Right. So, yeah. So, playthrough will continue, like, tomorrow, I guess. Um, or whenever, really. Um, yeah. So, cheers for watching. So, I'm going to go to bed. Quite tired. You alright, honey bunny? Hang on a minute. Oh. Did I plug the camera in? Bye.
Did I plug the camera in? Uh, no, I don't believe I did. Hang on. Right, there we go. Boom, 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 boom. There she is. So she's currently on the sofa eating a dried duck foot. Dried duck's foot, even. Um, which is crunchy and tasty, and they like it. Yes. Lulu, are you a good girl? Are you a good girl? Do you not give a shit? She doesn't give a shit. Yeah, she's fine. She's got her treat. She's happy. She's healthy. Um, right, cool. So um, yeah, I'll be uh, I'll be around tomorrow tomorrow evening. Uh, I'll be busy in the morning and the afternoon. Um, yeah. So cheers for watching. Uh, so insofar as YouTube is concerned, uh, the next video starts on Monday. And um, yeah, right. I'm gonna yeah time for bed. Right. Okay. Hang on. Um, who's playing what? So we've got four members of ZF playing. So who's on? So Yuki's on. He's playing Rust, I think. Smeagol's on playing CSGO. Kyla's on playing PUBG. And Gracie is on. Haven't seen her in a very long time. Uh, hang on. Right. I'll hand you over to Yuki. Oh, no, wait. This isn't... Sorry, that's not Rust. That's the forest. Yeah. Right. Cool. So take care. All the best. Have a, lov uh, have a lovely evening. And, uh, yeah, if you're in the UK, enjoy the weather.